On this episode of Kerwin Talks, we're going to be talking to two of the world's most interesting men, Ian Isaiah and Shane Oliver. We're going to get to know them. <laughs> I haven't seen you in so long, bro. This is crazy. It's so good to see you. <laughs> Love your place. Oh, my God. Thank you. I just it's moved down. It's a great down. place. Yeah. It's really nice. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> it's like the closet. Hmm? Is this the closet? This is the closet. I yeah. love it. I, this is the I closet. Um, <laughs> there's not that many interviews on you guys, so it's like super yeah. rare to just even have you in a room. Oh. Um, oh. We're blessed to be here. Yeah. yeah. Even seeing you guys together, it's like the nostalgia is just crazy. The beat. Yeah. So, how'd you guys, because you guys went to high school together, right? We didn't. Mm-mm. No. I met Shane. I read that I, somewhere. I think we met at the end of high school. I met him at the end of high school. How'd that happen? We'll come discuss me. age difference. <laughs> We're not, no, we, but, we can. Right. <laughs> we can discuss I age met Shane at the much. end of high school for mm-hmm. me. I guess it was the end of high school for him, too. We yeah. Met. Mm-hmm. And then um, downtown, you know, she was a light. Right. <laughs> at the end of the tunnel? She was a light and a huge tunnel right. for all of us. So queens. In the dark. Yeah. Downtown. <laughs> Where'd y'all meet? Downtown. Just in the dark. downtown. Oh, Just in downtown the in the dark. She was the light. She, this is the beginning of what sh- Shane walking around saying what I want to do, kind of thing. Right, right. Very oh, rare you hear him say, yeah. yeah, this is what I want to do, or this is what I should, <laughs> should do. This right. is those days. Yeah. The golden days of like, this was like, you know, the golden days. Right. It was performance. Yeah, perf- when she was the performance. So it was like, I didn't have any collection, <laughs> so I went to I used to see Shane used to pick me up from my retail job. Mm-hmm. Oh my God. Which yes. I don't want to say the name of. <laughs> Shane used to pick me up from my retail job even if I worked I my job okay I'll just say it I used to work at Urban Outfitters wow flex. in Soho okay 628 bro so you were in your bag I was in my bag and we were all young and we were all trying to be in bags <laughs> right, 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 down right, the right. block she's doing this yeah. down the block Shane's doing this down so the block bad. Somebody's doing this. Yeah. Nikki, oh, Nikki Diamond. Remember Nikki Diamond? Nikki Diamond. <laughs> Down the block, Pharrell's doing this. Down the block, uh, it's like mm-hmm. Soho. Yeah. Oh my 20 God, years the twins ago. were around at that time as well. I remember that look? Where the twins? I actually them. Um, the Lego, twins? The Lego twins. Oh, whatever. Shit. Remember those kids? Dean and Ricky. Dean and Ricky. Ricky, yes. Yeah. The yes. Lego twins. Yeah, yeah Dean and Ricky. Twins, but. <laughs> my boys. But that was the beginning of that. Shane used to pick me up from work and we all used to just huddle up in Soho. Mm-hmm. Just no money. Me. Just ready to keep. Damn. Hanging out. That that was like... That's funny because that's the same idea thing. Idea overload. Like, that's the same thing I did. You guys were like first class. Like me and Luca. Yeah, just and hanging out. We all did that. Yeah. So right after. It's like, why not, yeah. why not just do that? Yeah. And that kind of doesn't <laughs> exist anymore. I it know, doesn't. it's weird that it doesn't. everyone picked up on that. No, the vibe yeah. is different. I think I was I guess going... Instagram is like a new Soho. Right, it's like the lead. Mm-hmm. Well, people are afraid to be a team and be army-driven. People right. are so, like, right I now, do this by myself. More than any time, it's like, right yeah, now, I could do it by myself. Like, I can do it by myself. You can. You can. You really you can. Super can. You need the squad, because yeah. it's like... This person knows this, and like you need that outside perspective. Like when you're in your bag, you need someone to like snap you out of yeah. it and be like. Mm-hmm. You also mm-hmm. just That's might be a genius for your ideas alone. Right, That's true. Right, yeah. You yeah. are considered an icon for that alone. You mm-hmm. know, and there are people that you, as a leader, grab, and they already are like gifted in this area of yeah. production or in this area. Right. Of, like, I'm gonna follow through with this. Yeah. And delegate this. Since you already gave us a genius idea, which I didn't have. Right, right. You know, and then there's that team. And then there's that team that builds the other team. But, like, yeah. it's so hard nowadays for, like, a young person or young artist or young idea person to right. do that. Because it's like, I'm going to try to do this by myself. Right, right. Do you think I it's think just social media makes it look yeah, and like I, you don't have to put the years in? I always I have bet. this because now kids come up to me and they bring me their shirts like it's their mixtape. Right, right, right. And I don't mind tangibility though. I don't mind it, but I think if you can't just I can't just do that if it's not. Yeah, but you can look at a shirt and tell that okay, all right, you want to be famous. I, right. I said tangibility. I didn't say a t-shirt. Okay, okay. Like, <laughs> it doesn't have to be a t-shirt, but I don't mind that idea of like, oh well, you in my face. I'm right, gonna right. give you what I have. No, of course, because that's Should what we Should it be a t-shirt? Do. Maybe not. I, yeah. <laughs> Should we... it be? Your best thing, absolutely. Yeah, if, that, if you're gonna go down like that, right, but I right. don't mind that idea of like, oh, you're in the building. Right. I, I, I'm, you I'm gonna pull up me. on you. I'm yeah. gonna pull up on you. Right. And let you have it. But I, not give. But you, you would like, give the best. 
You would yeah. get the best. You would get the best. You would get yeah. what you knew. Yeah, exactly. Because you don't want it to be like that ATL scene. It's not a festival. Where, 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 where Ludacris throws a mixtape in, in the toilet. Right. Like, you know what I mean? It's just like, show. I feel like now what the perception is, is that you kind of like, you start a brand and then you think you could be like, just like, like Matthew Williams, Virgil, you guys, like you could be that status. But people don't know that there was so many years put in yeah. to like, yeah. Either not doing nothing, like deciding to be broke because you wanted to wait for the right moment and not, you know, sell quick. Yeah. Um, figuring out structure, figuring out the team, and that's yeah. like I feel like what's like misguided. Yeah, on the it. kids, the kids have a, a few things wrong. I also feel like what was <laughs> cute about us and the other kids that were around us is that we were like the ones that had to hang out. Yeah, like we cultivated so crazy that like we were the people that you came to hang out with, right, regardless, right. and then. Whatever we did in the daytime, whatever we did professionally, yeah. was professional. Yeah. That went to buyers. It wasn't like we were like riding off of that. It was like when you saw us, it was the spot. It's you know a different vibe. You, know, yeah. you know what I mean? It wasn't percent. never like, oh, and we're wearing a t-shirt and this and that. Yeah. And it's not like really that. People like eventually began to like follow us and cultivate our looks. Right, right. But we were never like on it like, oh, this is like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, um, yeah, I don't was, know. We kept it, was it professional. Like, well, the t-shirt it was just was, different. went to I mean, 7 New York. The t-shirt went to stores. Right. We never were like, also, oh, we're making t-shirts. You know, we were making t-shirts. Didn't yeah. know what the fuck I was doing. Didn't know what right. the fuck we were doing. <laughs> right, right, right. It was an opportunity where like, we were able to like, do, be ourselves in clothes. Right. So it wasn't like making clothes. It was making what we knew. Yeah. Right. And the support of Or people, making what you wanted to see in the world. Yeah. Well, no, and making from what we knew. That's a fact. And from also what we knew is that we weren't the only people that knew it. Yeah, we yeah. We grew up in Brooklyn. There's millions of people <laughs> in Brooklyn. Yeah. So they also knew it. Yeah. So it was just a way of like every piece also had a story. Every yeah, piece and, had like a idea that you already knew. It was just right, real right. now. And that's yeah. how the idea got out there even more so is because the kids in the hood actually fucked with it. Right, right. And it wasn't like, oh, we're in the cool clique. It was like, yeah, we're here because, like, this is where we hang out and that's, like, just, like, Soho. Right. But, like, actually, like... It wasn't getting, about it being We're getting so orders right. from, like, the kid on the block being like, right. what t-shirt is that? Like, yeah, like, yeah. Like, I, like, how do I cop that? You yeah. Know? So I think, like, that's the difference now, too, is, like... It's maybe too cool, too fast. It's too cool, too or fast. Or something, you know, like, where you don't... Yeah, they don't They don't have, like, a heritage built into it right. that feels genuine. It could also just yeah. be opposite. Like, um, when <laughs> we started, there was already fashion. Right. Houses are... Houses were already in effect. Right, like, right, right. Standing, st- like, standing still. Like, yeah. houses were there. Fashion is fashion. Right. Culture, sure, they had culture too. Yeah. Was it downtown? No. Absolutely not. Did yeah. we get to touch it? Absolutely no. not. No, we had a sneak in. You would only see us in a look if it was vintage or if it was on sale. Right. No money downtown. Yeah, we, no. Like, we no. were the look. We didn't have the money. Yeah. We gave the white girls enough. They were <laughs> they were stealing enough. Let's just be honest. White people have been stealing for years. White people have been stealing for so long. And especially in fashion, and especially well, in music too, but let's just talk about fashion. Right. Yeah. In styling and fashion, it got to a point of an uproar for like styling right. in general for downtown. Yeah. Us. Like from the gay world to the West Indian culture world that we went home to every day from being in our dream world or right. being in Soho acting fashion right we still went home to brooklyn and crown heights where like tight jeans was priority yeah and like h&m accessories were priority on black men with skinny braids yeah because this is the look we are reference we're already fashion over style for at least (laughs) 20 years now fashion over style um bogle uh dance hall king who died r.i.p his his soul yeah (laughs) but that's where we're from fashion over style it's like this is what we knew. Right. And it, it, I think we just, I think, honestly, well, 
in between, also Shane also being the only one who was like, all right, well, I actually want to be a designer. Right. Meanwhile, I'm like, I want to sing. Do, 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 do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I want to do this. Yeah, I'm going to help you. Let's do this. Do, do, right. do, do, do. And then from that, just cultivating and cultivating and just like stirring up pots, just right. stirring up pots for years, this, that, and third, where we created lanes for ourselves where it's like, we're doing what we know. This is why yeah. I post it like this. It's nowhere to copy. Right. Now a days the kids have a huge reference board, so it's really difficult right, right. for you to like actually stand out because there's a reference for you. Right. So you need to think opposite. Opposite. And to stop like it's a lot of time spent on trying to create a mood board when it's already there. Yeah. Not saying that you're not gonna Look do at anything the world different. Like you're in. I'm not saying you're not gonna do anything different. I'm just right. saying like platform foundation is there. Right. So you can just you know like follow through right. And you know, and you see what's missing. Totally. As opposed to like, we uh, back in the day we used to you, we we referenced so that we wouldn't do what people did already. Right. Yeah. Whereas like now it's like everyone tries to link it and think that they're not looking at the same reference. When yeah, they're everyone looking at the same Honestly, after exact reference images. Two, it's three like, seasons in the HBA. Every reference from then on was just HBA. We yeah, we just literally were referencing ourselves. Referencing Got it out building. in the beginning. Yeah. Like, oh, this is well because you built. The aesthetic, yeah. like from scratch, exactly. Mm -hmm. And there it's wasn't, I feel like it's there wasn't much now. of that. Yeah, it is opposite now. It's because opposite now, or now it's like you know you think of a dark name, and then someone like tries to make like a logo brand, and like it's <laughs> right. such a joke. I'm like right. like Psych World or some shit like that. Right, $200 it's just a joke. For an LLC. It's just stupid. <laughs> Don't know what you're doing. It's like it's it's, it's buffoonery. It's true. But like you guys what? were. were Y'all captivated so much. Yeah, but it's a new day and age. So I do still want to inspire people to be able to do because of course. You, need, you need people to move on and do. It's just a certain new way to do it, I think. I think it's tech. I think it's like tech yeah. now. It's like figure out how to like, I don't know, foundation and tech and then just revert it back yeah. to fashion. Just Fashion's already made. Fashion, the look is right. there. So, no, it's true. I'm sorry. And, some years just don't have and I'm not tooting horns. I'm not boasting. Literally, there's foundation <laughs> for you. Like, so, and we had to also realize that we weren't um, we weren't those type of designers like those houses where like they just repeat and repeat just to keep the house going, right, which right. is fine. Business, that's what's up. Mm -hmm. But so you have to. We also had to realize that like, oh, maybe we are just the like foundationalist, you right. know, like or like founders to right, like right. help assist the next. I feel like you guys had to take like a million stones, yeah, to yeah. get to get this entire wave. Yeah. To the level it's out right now. Now the yeah. kids know how to do it, but and I feel it, like is it like yeah. do they have? I mean, this sounds crazy, but do they have the taste? Right. You really can't right. like. We all know how to make a t. We all know how to do it. Do you have the taste? What's the reason why? And there's also you wear t-shirts. It's also a lot of why bad. Are there's you? a lot of bad milk and fruit. Yeah, <laughs> there's, a, there's a huge mixture of like the but, refrigerator needs to get cleaned yeah, out for mean sure. Mean fast fashion <laughs> that's going on. Yeah, that like really needs to take it easy. Yeah, and it's but, volatile. It's like aggressive and angry. It's I almost feel like angry at like. Kids for being cool. Yeah. You know, the, the, the people that make the clothes are like hate the customer well, so much. This is what I was going to say. It was That's like, you would, no you would be in Soho, you would be in Soho then, um, and like, this like, this hood dude who just like, for the first time in his life saw like a Basquiat documentary, he comes up to you and he's like, Yo, like I drew on the sweater. This is my art, right. and he's like, "All right, yeah, cool, yeah. right?" But now you walk into Balenciaga, and that's on the rack. Right, that's, that's on the rack. True. And and another thing I noticed was yeah. like what you guys did, and I, this is like what I feel like 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 you guys are owed a lot of apologies. But one of them, oh, God. a lot. I'm sorry, uh -oh. a lot. But I one of them, <laughs> one of them was um, how people couldn't understand the division of, of, of hood buyer classics and hood by air right. and try to label you guys on t-shirts but now but now literally all of high end is t-shirts and people right. are doing that and there is no blurred line between streetwear and high fashion yeah, it was like, but why, you guys touched that first yeah it was like why with us did it have to be so so, so, so specific. specific it's like why do we have to call out and you have to yeah. say this is streetwear this is not yeah you know it's like now you know, I guess because we lived in, like, it not being that way, then right. it became, like, the norm. But, you like, it was just, like, yeah. such a stickler. Everyone was like, so, wait, I don't get it. I still don't get it. After seeing the whole show, they would be like, I still don't get it. I Is still it don't get way? it, yeah. And you're like, okay. Well, I, I saw, I, I was just watching. just go on record and say we shook the world up. Yeah. 100%. And when, but once it got shook up and shook the culture up, yeah. 
white people lost their minds. Yeah, they did. The councils lost their minds. <laughs> Fashion lost their minds. They didn't know what to do. What <laughs> happens when white people lose their mind? They like they capitalize. Yeah, and they get and angry this is what happened. and volatile, but, and it's aggressive. I, but even it's, it's a cycle. I just <laughs> my problem with it is kind of like That's how much white people. I love white people. Yeah. <laughs> 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 um, it it really didn't get its proper proper documentation and and the, I'm sorry, like the show, the people at Show Studio don't get it. Mm. They don't. I'm sorry. I know they did a lot. I know there's a close yeah, relationship. Yeah. They you know, don't Nick, get it. Nick is so cool, but I get where you're st- like. I get like that. <laughs> It's still the, the it's the way that the, the eye that's looking at it, right? That's saying like, oh my god, isn't this so interesting? These kids are doing something really I like cool. Nick. When yeah. it's like, yeah, I love Nick. But what's it's the just, guess? But even it's not even about Nick. It could be like the people who are there reporting on it, and it's just like that's true. HBA was made out without you guys because you guys never, never ever had a statement where you were like. Yeah, this is around like the gay world, and like right, right, we. Right. Yeah. yeah, this is around burning Paris, and you said that once, yeah. and literally took it and ran with it for ten years. Right, right. right. And it's like it's not about that. They yeah. were like, like a shirt with two zippers is, is sexual. It's like, what well, the fuck are you talking about? Right, right, yeah. No. <laughs> well, when we came in, we came in storming. We, yeah. It wasn't also a culture disruption. It was right, also right. gay black people right right Versus yeah gay black people without a voice that's a whole other yeah. situation but that's why you guys went to a art that's a whole right. other mountain it was like and you guys then gonna... black people being respected in real fashion shame being respected yeah. by anna in real fashion people like that yeah so two of these mountains moving at once is like literally disrupting yeah it was right, crazy right. It was a like, whole era mixed them like, with percentage of music and that influence like yeah they don't know what to do with the head even hip-hop had to deal with the fact that they were they yeah come that they were wearing it the and then like oh shit yeah. making yeah. clothes you know? so, and it was like it went from like oh like there was there's the the diddy sean john yeah and that okay that being that image for them to buy clothes from and that being okay so like a kid wearing pum pums right right you know what i mean yeah. and balenciaga glasses and yeah. saying like actually i'm gonna t- tell and teach men how to dress right, right. And, you know so, what I mean? and so that's um, like a huge artists were birthed from it you know yeah, right. other yeah. ideas were birthed other babies grew up and realized oh this is missing in this area yeah now all of a sudden seating is an actual thing well, in housing yeah, yeah. You know, now there's a, a and now it's an that's actual true. thing again from the 90s again. well that's what i, I came know? up watching you guys but like, this is what i'm saying is like not it was more for everybody else to just flow and actually right, create right. all these different rather than it be now. for them they're yeah, not going to get it regardless like, whether you, know, you literally type it in yeah, the best and way and now the things that we thought were just ideas are now jobs like girls have jobs. jobs like seating Full. is a job for someone right, right, you right. know influencing is a job right, right you know which right. is great but yeah. like i wish that was around when we were around i know we were getting red <laughs> out for doing stuff like that and being I didn't like, mind the reading. The well, reading course, made me know readings, that things were going right. Yeah, yeah, of course. Getting the read always made me. But the, also, because I think, okay, this sounds very boastful, but it was very pure. We literally came from what yeah. we knew. And we already dealt with the biggest bullies. Yeah. Gangsters. These gun yeah. holders. Right. <laughs> slingers. In the, the neighborhood. When yeah, we were just yeah. ideas. Oh, I don't have any money. Oh, give me a scissor. Cut this up. I'm right. going out. You right, know? Right, right. Dealt with those girls. Yeah. Walk of shame going out. Right, right. Walk of shame come, waiting for the car, Bible the taxi. Scrum. Walk walk of shame <laughs> through Bible school. Right. Walk of shame all the way home. Walk of shame your sibling seeing you. Exactly. And so some already men do walk of shame before right, right. it was even a also a look in HBA yeah. walk of shame. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like already been through that <laughs> at home in the hood, which made it very pure. Right, right. So that all other fashion reads yeah, yeah it really, really singers of the world yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, the the editors of the world you know the write-ups of the world really didn't matter because yes, they sir. also right. didn't know what to say about it yeah you know um uh little richard i'm carrying but little richard um <laughs> little richard was like singing like losing his mind and right. all this kind of stuff they didn't know what to call it white people all of a sudden oh let's call it rock and roll this and that like they didn't know what to say when they don't know what to call you when you're an artist they see um they love to like just throw you in an alternative box right. or throw you in like a non-label i don't understand you yet yeah question mark situation and that's all i see from like when we, when we get red no, from like yeah. fashion people well, I even like I, I got that same New York Times or something like that I'm like oh well you don't get it yeah for me HBA though 
um, and I, I didn't notice this till, till I, I got to Paris. Um, I, I pulled some, some HBA archives from me a couple weeks back, and uh, one of the things uh, I, got to, I got to get was uh, the, the orange Velcro uh, uh, crew neck. Yeah, yeah. And, oh, I remember this. Yeah, I was going to wear it. <laughs> I was going to wear it, and literally, I, like, touched the, the Velcro, and immediately, like, just got a flashback of, like, being a kid, like, wow. at Mike the Ruler's house, being his babysitter. <laughs> oh, wow. And he's, like, going crazy, like, Mike, what are you making? He just cut this, like, towel into a tank top. Wow. And he, he was, like, showing me how you could wear, like, an HBA shirt into a wow. fucking skirt. <laughs> and so, like, I wore the HBA Velcro patch as a crown. Right. Yeah. And, but that was, that. that was the feeling I got because oh, it was so wow. emotional. That's cool. Mike was so he was the HBA mascot like right, 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 right. like official unofficial like uh, sponsored yeah, mascot sure. oh, crazy. and was like yeah like he was there with all of it on and like gave it that feeling and and that carried with me and yeah you look great yeah it I was never a, saw him wear with a crown yeah well that was crazy I, I mean that, that was like yeah that was amazing yeah man. no matter no matter what it's like when you wear it you feel that that sense of family I mean like Dior gave me standing yeah. at their yeah. show. Wow. And I was like, mm, all right, I'm going to give them a reason to, to, to make me stand. Right. <laughs> so I pulled out the gray suit with the Sinead O'Connor shirt, yeah, the Loire it. custom wings, right. and the, 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 the Takashi Murakami sneakers, like, pulled up late to the show yeah. with the cane, like, yeah, you're, like I'm going to stand yeah, now. Yeah. Like, but... <laughs> yeah, you planned that out well, actually. No, that was Paris great. was good. But that's right. the energy, you guys, like, that, like... Yeah, that's the energy that we need more of. Like, yeah. That. Yeah, because it's that, gone. It it's reminded like, me of old energy. Yeah, one hundred percent. That's referencing in a right way. Yeah, yeah. yeah like, of course. I kept telling everyone, like, her, everyone kept saying it like Kermit's in the mood. Like, <laughs> I was like, yeah. like oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's just no, too much. Great. Yeah, that was great. That whole moment, like, really. I was like, okay, I did some hope. Yeah, it's just you know? dry now. It's yeah, just yeah, like, yeah. Uh, like a, like you wear like. Like a beanie, some kind of like big flannel jacket and like a sweater, and it's like I think it's just super pretentious, too it's, merchy. It's, it's, a little it's too, so merchy. Yeah. It's mannequin, which is yeah. why consumers matter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But totally. styling, the styling yeah. is crazy. Yeah. It's like, yeah. the styling is crazy. Like, it's, it's, it's yeah. It's, it's like three generations <laughs> too old. Like, that shit is like. <laughs> Like Sonic Youth, like this is crazy. I don't get why the merch plan hasn't changed yet. Yeah, that's true. Think, yeah, like, yeah. You the know, it's like, hasn't what? It's, it's, like mark, box, it's, yeah. it's like mark by mark. It's like oh, that's what shit name. still looks that's what like. Shit still looks like, yeah. You know what I mean? Like Damn. I don't know. It's weird, and it's weird. I know. <laughs> well, I'm just saying, like, you know, yeah. that look. It's still like the grunge. It's like grunge, but also yeah. it's like Europeans haven't had a chance to bite into that yeah and i think that that's why it's so popular now because they are now doing what we already did as a country right but doing it in their houses in their houses yeah. so also every fashion house at the end of the day you know if you're like a cuckoo house that makes like <laughs> concept conce conceptual shit right you need a merch plan every house needs a merch plan yeah. yes but you're just because you need a merch plan does not mean you need uh, quantity right, right. in merch plans. You know, yeah. you just need to like dial, like dilute the idea of right. like your idea a little bit, just so that these little girls can get it and buy it yeah. and right, keep you living. Right. Keep it you right. can't just they like, want it. Yeah. They want something. You can't else. just That's overflow sure. quantity. It doesn't work like that because then you don't, you you won't have a customer. Customer. Yeah. You won't have ambassadors. You won't have like. You won't have no one like actually repping your shit. Repping, you'll just yeah, have organically. like you'll have Kids like this like yeah. from brand production, to brand. which is gonna move you further down in production world where you're gonna have to like oh everybody wants this damn I can't afford to like keep making this I gotta yeah. go get cheaper shit well, what to was, keep it going and stuff like that you know what I mean yeah so it's like you got to be careful. What was that like? It was oh well, you got what well, what well, early 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 like how did you guys manufacture all everything that you did? I think and, like how that happened. We went in knowing that it was a little car and we were learning a lot, but <laughs> also we went in knowing that it wasn't about quantity. Right, right. You know, we went in knowing that like, well, we're not just creating something brand new. We're also giving a brand new confidence to apparel in general. Right, yeah. Which was confidence meaning like, oh well, 
we maybe we don't need that this much stuff. Yeah, uh, cut, yeah. Cut half of this jean off. Right. That's that's cheaper to make. <laughs> yeah, right. Right. But, but like not. certain ideas and certain like foundations of HBA is like built off confidence level mm-hmm. clothing. And what like some you you could buy something in a store and you might not be as confident in it until you go home and grab a pair of scissors or do something or right, it right, or right. just stress it. To, like the hammer. Just stress it to where it's comfortable letter. for you to like look better in right. it. So like we already had that idea with the outfits in general with confidence. You know, yeah. you're not gonna get a t shirt. You know, yeah. you might get half of a t shirt. So right. that's production. half of production. I'm giving like <laughs> blah blah blah, you know, like the idea was set on confidence, so like quantities weren't I mean in all natural world, in, in a, well, in the perfect world, yeah. business world, you know, you want to create a lot of quantities. Yeah. So, you know, like, you, you don't want. Yeah. But, you know, like, in this case, you know, building a certain foundation, you know, it's not really about that. It's about, yeah. like, no, I influencing mean, that's... the right ambassador, influencing the right people to wear these looks right. You know, right, I can spend right. a lot of money trying to, like, specifically yeah. make four hoodies really, together yeah. and then you go home and put it on and you look crazy. You don't know and what you you're look doing. Corny. It's like, it's like yeah. we, I think we spend a lot of time <laughs> trying to tell people how, which is why how to walk, so the, line. Like, how to walk, how to walk the line. Yeah, how to do it. Like, it's like, no, like, you style it like this. This is a jean, yeah. but yeah. you wear a jean yeah. like this. Yeah. You wear it with this item. Tell me about the. The Ventro collab. Wow. Okay, that was. This let's, was. Let's talk about it. <laughs> I love culture like, collab. Listen, Virg is my sis. Yeah, he works. Virgil worked for HBA, right? That's, it's uh, not yeah, a culture yes, collab. He did. He did. He did. He worked for HBA. Okay. Um, that's my sis. Mm-hmm. But that got taken a little out of control. I think. <laughs> Matthew took the reins on that one and pushed it to like twelve hundred. It was literally a T shirt for a party. Oh, Remember, wow. it was literally a what? day event. Wow. It was fun. A daytime event. A daytime event, and then <laughs> everything fun. went brunch. haywire. Brunch. A brunch. It was a brunch. Yeah. Was it was a brunch tea. We yeah. gave it out at the brunch. Wow. And then it became like a fucking phenomenon. It was at the brunch. Like, Walk me through this Just brunch. like Bari, you know, the, the girls. It was the house kids. Like, okay. it was like, yeah, you know, yeah. all the dolls. Yeah. It was a, a house full of dolls, for sure. And then Matthew was like, oh, you guys asked for like 20, but yeah, and I actually like, made 50,000. Right. <laughs> it, oh, oh, I don't know when that happened. I don't know how it went about. No, no, wait, wait. Uh, like, how did it go down? <laughs> all right, okay. I think, all right, first of all, it was a brunch. Okay. And it was a fun brunch. Yeah. It was. It was also the meeting ground because I don't think I've ever met Matt and Heron and Virgil before oh this God, brunch. Really? Alejandra was there. I don't, yeah, was I don't there. think I Everyone met them before. Was there. We weren't Venus. friends before the brunch. I didn't really know them before the brunch. Yeah. Did you know about them though? Yeah, well, not I was really. really Everyone, you, uh, you've heard about them. I've heard about them. Like, everybody yeah. heard about each other. Yeah. yeah. And like, like, obviously, exactly. I had met Matthew before that. Shane already met him, so yeah. I met them, obviously, through Shane. But okay. um, it was just a brunch, you know, fun brunch. Yeah. They were t-shirts. Everyone loved it, blah, blah, blah. But I think what the happened was that, what I think happened was, um, I think, Yeezy influenced the t-shirt. I think Matt or Virgil got it on Yeezy or something right. like that. And then the t-shirt got out of hand. Right. From there. And we couldn't, we didn't know how to control it without it getting involved. Kind of cool. You know what I mean? Yeah. It was like, okay, we can have our logo out there and everyone is going to like get into it. Yeah. And then be like, you can't really what send a that? cease and desist to this. Right. Exactly. It's, it's like, you can't really like, we had to take control of it somehow. So we had to get involved. You know wow. what I mean? Wow. So you had no like, choice. This is like a, a lot of things with HBA. That's how, what had happened. <laughs> really? Too. It was like, even like with, uh, you know, uh, certain rappers right right we were like how the fuck did it get on him it, no, it was like no we got on him and then it got out of control and then like it was like a whole nother consumer <laughs> that we didn't even know how to control and we had to like wait, wait. then take take you know advantage of that yeah. and sort of which is something we had range. to learn right. we had to learn this you know and everyone thinks that, that we were being shady when it was really just we were like trying to control we didn't the brand. control it yeah, we yeah. didn't understand that. it yeah, yeah. You know I mean? remember we're coming in with this idea of confidence that was missing in fashion yeah right. so we weren't even looking for a celebrity or any sort of like collaboration with anything to help push because right. we're like wait this is what you're missing right, so it's right. like we're pushing us this yeah. is what, not us as people but just us in this whole yeah exactly house we're yeah, pushing yeah. this house this is what you're missing. It was everyone. But we didn't understand not totally. that like I guess you needed that in yeah. that time. You needed you don't that. See that time. Well because it's just like but like I don't understand like what was the difference between us and like a Rick. You don't ask right, Rick right, right. to put to 
put you on an official level yeah. if you wear Rick Owens. Right, right. You're wearing Rick, <laughs> and that's it. Right. You know, why is it not the same with us? You yeah. wear an HBA t shirt, that's, that's fucking it. it. Yeah. You don't have to be like, yeah. you know, you don't have to own it, you don't have to like whatever. Yeah. And that was what our logic was. We were just like, we want to supply really good uh, like designs for people. But we don't want it to be like, oh my god, it's you know. It's At like, the same time, as much as like that collab was like just helping everything, it was also fucking shit up. Right, exactly. But like, not not intentionally, not intentionally. Well, not intentionally. No, it no, wasn't no. intentional no. on both sides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was fucking shit up. It was disruptive. <laughs> yeah, but, like most iconic. Because like, it's like people didn't even at that point. At least we didn't even get have a time to educate them in certain things about us. Right, you know I mean? right, right. They That's true. They could have learned more stuff. Yeah, about before that. To then be like, oh, before now you guys I got, got in bed. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah, exactly. And so it's like when someone doesn't really know the brand and they're just getting it to get it, and then they figure out what the brand actually After. is about, and they're like confused. Right. I for for one, I also didn't get that either. I was like, why do we have to like be apologetic for like what we're about? Yeah, what we're about. Because y'all don't talk to Rick and Rick is doing piss videos. Yeah, yeah. Like, why is it okay for a, a white, well, a yeah. seemingly white person to do that? Yeah. You know what I mean? And then us, we have to explain ourselves. Explain or we everything. have to feel, like, weird about where we come from yeah. or how we act. What does this mean? Who we are, really. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it was just, like, creating, like, this, like, weird boundary thing. But, you know, I felt like it was great because we were with people that we genuinely did like to be, like, Verge. I mean, to, to be honest, I really... Like him, like I think yeah. it's like fun and like you know we get along really. Well, good. no, if it wasn't yeah. about Virgil Abloh, Matthew Williams, Aaron Preston. This was Ben Trill, right? Hood by it was, right. It was and like, full, like let's yeah, be real. Moment. Yeah, it's it a marketing. Full, it, this is yeah, like it's it not total marketing. Yeah, this isn't Hood by Air, Off White, oh Pyrex. You know what I mean? This is like Ben Trill. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, you going too far. That though. was good times. Yeah, <laughs> that was a, yeah. Yeah. It was about it, it, it was about it was cute. Yeah, it was innocent. It was innocent. And there was V files. Right. G1 she. Yeah. She G1 won she was pop. Yeah. Oh Jesus. Yeah. If you mention V files and uh Pyrex, we could mention G1 she. No, it's yeah. true. Well no, G1 she, she, she was she, part of that's yeah. very true. Let's, let's no. mention that's Ricardo's very true. streetwear. Oh, <laughs> His street that's weird. see so that's reverse. Like, okay, no, no. That was a reverse <laughs> version of that. So <laughs> I mean, we always battled that. Marcelo because, Berlan. Yeah, I no, mean the list keeps really going. That's it's, a gift, so keeps it yeah. it's yeah. a gift that keeps on giving. Yeah, <laughs> great names. All great names. <laughs> <laughs> All great names. <laughs> All great names. <laughs> I mean, I feel like that was a really weird time because we were just like, how are we a part of this? Again? Right, right. I don't know what we're Why doing. are we in this conversation? Yeah, yeah. Like, these are like older Italian men. Right. And we're like in Brooklyn doing right. something from our mom's spots. You know, yeah. how is the same thing? But it's totally not the same thing. Right. I don't know, but like, because like, again, that whole umbrella of marketing and like, it just becomes that, you know? It becomes that, yeah. Um, Both sides didn't know what was going on. Yeah, I, I think yeah. so, too. I think everyone was trying to grasp on Trying to grasp also, on Also, maybe it, that yeah. was okay. No, it was okay. It was, play, it was innocent. Playful. Yeah. It was innocent. And you could see it as that, but yeah. there's two I sides of looking at it. Or there are three sides, and yeah. then the third party got involved, and then, like, capitalized over the whole thing. What was the third party? Just Ooh. white people. Okay. Just, like, people, I know fashion people about. with money. Yeah, you're like a, yeah, you're a, Europe. Yeah, Europe. Uh, I mean, it's like yeah. yeah, we can help you make whatever you want. Yeah. Oh, this I'll scratch is your great. back. You scratch mine. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. Like, you know. <laughs> so they scratch you into a corner. You're freaking the fuck right. out. Well, exactly. now everyone's yeah. in great corners. Right. right, right <laughs> so right, like, yeah. sometimes you have to give in order. Sometimes you have to put down some sort of investment to reap your savings later on. You know, right. maybe this is what reaping savings looks like. Everyone has their own house and it's doing well. Yeah. But also, you know, like it came from disruptive. Like things, and it fucking came shit from up like and shaking it around, slight clashes, and like, yeah, you know, slight narcissisms everywhere, slight yeah. this, slight that. How do you slight guys? Slight eyes yeah. and not teams. Like it was that. Mm-hmm. How do you guys? <laughs> How do you guys feel about like all the fakes? Mm-hmm. All the all the like just like counterfeit HBA. I like see it all the time in Japan. I, I, oh, you thought I'm fake people? Oh, no, no, that's no, another no, no, interview. No. I love it. I love it. <laughs> oh, I'll be there for that. <laughs> I love it. 
Yeah. I've been, we've been seeing it forever. Yeah. Yes. It's, right. it's so funny. Sometimes the context would just be like, <laughs> they'll even go more black than we ever went. I've seen Like, I've seen goes. them put little black kids on t shirts and say it by ear. Do you see no one? Yes. I was like, no, they did not <laughs> take it the roots on us. Like, and it's good because it's like they almost get it more. Right, was, right. Kind of they get I've it seen more. full markets in Shanghai, China. Really? Just, like, looks. I bought them. Right. Cute looks. Cute like, looks. Yeah. Fusion looks. Uh, where it's Nick, like uh, our friend Nick <laughs> went to like India and shot a bunch of like Fugazi tees. Yeah. That on like ran. Oh, I know Nick. Like, Nick's out there. Yeah, he has a yeah. whole. There's a whole story. He went to like India and to shot, India. Like, yeah, and he put it on oh, the kids. We gave him some clothes too, but there was also like yeah, all like, this other stuff too. Like, yeah. it was fire. Um, so I like I saw dashikis before. Wow. I saw like um at Afropunk girls with hood by air dashikis. I'm like, what's happening? <laughs> That's a vibe. Um, like, That's a vibe. I love it. It's a vibe. It's good. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. And I think that that's when I was like, I mean, that's one of the reasons like, oh, so we just know it's more, it's better, it's like bigger than you. And you're just yeah. like, the impact of like what you are doing. So, okay, another bullet point besides fight. the confidence is yeah. we also own screen printing. Right. Okay. I mean, let's be, I'm not going to, should we oh. read? Is that a reason? Yeah. Well, what, on. screen print? Let's be clear, like, we worked with Verge, and it was, like, a moment. Yeah. But uh, all of those placements... Yeah. Are, the people don't even want to know the references for them. And yeah. what's so crazy is that they're all gay references. So that's... We're going to blow that up. Well, no, yeah. I don't want to say... Let's say... <laughs> no, we should... Let's funny. say... Let's say they are... Delinquent references right, right, that right. are very like not dark, but just like to the other side. For and the it's placements? weird. Yeah, like all oh. of those placements are like. Are you talking about the panels on the sleeves? Oh, panels on the, the sleeve. This the HBA here. Wow. That is literally from a documentary on gays in prison. Um, you know, like it's just like the context is like Damn, so amazing. lost. You know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, yeah, Because yeah. everyone thinks that it's about cool guys. Right, and like, right, right. And it's and about just placing it in a random place. Right, exactly. But it's like you guys completely. It was actually we even knew what yeah. we were doing. Damn. You know what I mean? From Placement the beginning, is the most fun. Yeah, so fun. <laughs> and that's what we would just we would take hours and hours just yeah, like putting so things everywhere right, and like making right. sure like and so I think you know um, there was a lot of love and hands like, hands-on, like, stuff to that. It's just weird to see it, like, um, being take out of con- taken out of context, I guess. Damn. What about the name and acronym? Um, like, the name Hood Buyer, but then you guys started using HBA, and also, yeah, yeah what's shorter. the name? What I mean, uh, to be honest, it came from that, from that oh, one graphic damn. that was, like... The block. The block, and we saw it in this in this documentary... And we were like, oh, word, that's the direction that we need to go in right now. But what about the name Hood by Air? Hood by Air. I mean, that name comes from... It's like the greatest name of all time. Yeah, it comes from, you know... At first it was, when I was doing it by myself... Yeah. It was... The brand was called Elite Elite Urban Brigade. Wow. (laughs) That's a brand that somebody hands you and (laughs) tells. I'm going to And it was just like, like... you know, it was about getting dressed, being cute, right, like just right. coming through. This and is when Shane was online. Yeah, oh, this wow. is when I used to actually have like Tumblr. Damn. <laughs> Raps. <Yeah. laughs> wow. Raps. Yeah, like actually going insane. Today's mood. You know, it was right. crazy, and then so it like evolved from that into Hood by Air eventually. So it just has to do with the idea of being, um, I guess, like where it's at now, where it's like the street ideas are way ahead of, like, the curve because they are essentially what people grow into eventually. Mm, yeah. And so the, if the smarter kids that understand that from a very young age are sort of the elite. Right, right. Opposed to, like, uh, the, the Other sheep, way around. You yeah. know what I mean? Um, I don't know how much it resonates with this generation. I feel right. like we're going through a process of them having to be sheep a little bit. Yeah. And then they'll they'll begin to wake up and, like, Find that figure out their own ways of doing things. Look away. Um, We're in a sheep, Tom. Yeah, that's a little sheepy. No shepherd. Who would you guys say like who are like the biggest sheep? Uh. I think we're in. There's a lot of sheep. <laughs> I'm just joking. There's a lot of sheep, not a lot of shepherds. Not a lot of shepherds. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Yeah. 
I do, you know, there's are... wild goats all over there's, the place. Yeah, there's goats let, let loose. <laughs> just wild animals just all, over the, all over the place. Uh, <laughs> pellets. They're just <laughs> spraying. <laughs> uh, no, I'm just... <laughs> no, 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 no. No, I mean, there are people that are... I think there are really intelligent people that are, like, uh, playing doing dumb? good. Yeah. They're and, playing dumb. Yeah. And doing good jobs at, like, at least leading people in positive directions yeah. and being positive towards what could the possibility of, of street kids, street culture, and keeping it open. Mm-hmm. But I don't necessarily think that they're teaching anyone uh, or showing new things or showing new things uh, that have not happened in fashion already. Yeah, right now it's kind of on like Groundhog Day. It's like day. everyone is ignorant okay. because they yeah. don't. Yeah, yeah exactly. Groundhog Day. Yeah, yeah exactly. That's, that's crazy. Yeah, it's tomorrow crazy. will be the same and it's, it'll be the same again. That's well put. And then you look at your category it's like, like, am I going crazy? Like, that's am I great. like, and, and you start thinking about yourself. Great retweet. Yeah. <laughs> no, I agree. Because you start thinking that yeah, and, and you're just like, wait, like, did I miss something? Right. Um, or, because you... I, I, it's like, I thought we were getting somewhere, and then all of a sudden, you're like, back five years again. Yeah. Like, okay, wait, what just happened? Right. But, you know... Because there's a lot of sheep. There's a lot there's of sheep, lot, yeah. A lot, a lot, and everything lot has to be spoon And out. validation. There's a lot of validation happening right now, so yeah. people are just, like, allowing... And they want validation first. First, yeah, before... So I that exactly. they can get started on the work. Exactly. <laughs> and I'm like, exactly. wait, I don't, you want to be certified <laughs> first mm-hmm. before you start, like... Before you take two hundred dollars and go get an LLC, you want to be yeah. certified on Instagram first. So, so like, crazy. you want like some sort of validation, or you want some sort of title or name. Yeah. And that's we we in history know that sucks. You know, yeah, artists no, can't sit in front of a thing and write. Boss guys didn't write the title of like right. his work this before he started doing it. It's yeah, like yeah. you can't title it first. You fuck it up. It's you can have a goal. Right. You can have a dream with the title. You can have a mood board. You can look at this word that you want to be. You want to be a millionaire? Sure. Look at it. Micromanage yourself and look at it and do that. Right. But you're not going to put that title on yourself until you have it. You know, mm-hmm. God's not going to give you a million dollars if you can't take care of $10,000. So you Damn. can have these names on a wall to look Damn. at and inspire to be. Right. But you it's... can't go and be like, hi, my name is Millionaire Ian Isaiah. <laughs> Absolutely yeah. not. Hi, it's perfect to be good in like, You have to be honest with yourself and go in there without this title because then you're oh, also the putting fake on Asians. this. You're also putting the on a narcissist. Asians? Yo, Wait, who are the fake Asians? No, no, not Asians. Ages. Ages. Yeah, because you put on these titles, you're also putting uh, on these narcissism hats. Yeah. You're putting on these lying hats that you can't fill. And you're putting on these hats that may just be dreams. Damn, that's so, going to go over yeah. a lot of people's heads. Yeah, like, you have to, like, relax in that hat. Like, yeah. Get, a, get, a, get an adjustment you gotta, hat. Yeah, that's the <laughs> thing. You know, like, don't, like, start throwing these titles on you, you know? Like, dream yeah. about these titles. Write them down. Look which, them. No, which titles are you talking about? You're talking being about... Being like, a millionaire, being a business person, or being a creative a brand director, name, being a creative director, being any title right, that you want right. to be. Like, you know, like, don't call yourself that. Yeah, you know, the creative like, director. Everyone's a creative director. 2014. Like, Do you even know? Craziest <laughs> five, six years of my life. <laughs> like, everyone's like, everyone's like, everybody and full. their mother is a creative director. <laughs> <laughs> like, they tore Oprah up. You're a creative director. You're a creative director. It's so funny. It's so true, and you know that's okay. But write that down. You're not gonna, you know, like be who. Let me know your name first. You know, before your titles and dreams. Then I'm interested in your dreams. I'm not interested because you already gave me. I already know what you want to do because like yeah, don't tell me use cars. Yeah, at all. My wallet is full. (laughs) I I think the kids that are interesting now don't even really know what they want to be even. Yeah, Yeah. all they call themselves stylish, but they put all work and passion into the name. Yeah, that is done. Yeah, like, like, they burnt out themselves in the head already. Damn. It's like, damn, it don't work like that. No, it's true. And the ones that are interesting are like, I'm a stylist, but they really are doing other things. Other and things. Just, so I kind of like that. I like those kids that are just like willing to be like, I'm a stylist. Or, yeah. Right, right. I just fuck, I just fuck around. Right, right, right. You know what I mean? And I think that's kind of cool. It's like honest. It. It's like figure yeah, it out exactly. first. But it's, it comes with a lot of pressure of yeah. like, I think. 
like people used to just make up things they, they did or worked for. Mm -hmm. yeah, like validation. Yeah. This is also the same thing we had to do in the beginning. Yeah. You know, yeah, we had an idea, but we didn't have a venue. Yeah, yeah. we had an idea. We wanted to throw a party, but yeah. we didn't have a club. Yeah. Like, we had to have that same mentality to go talk to these like rich Jewish people yeah. downtown who are like, all right, bet. <laughs> Just well, giving you the bar, blah, blah, blah. With the just, film festival, you know, I shit. just had this old, dirty, scummy theater. And then, you know, called up Cash Up. And I was like, I want to do a film fine. festival next week. Yeah. Two right. days before, they literally, like, and I'm so grateful I'm able to do that. But it's literally, yeah, you say it until it's true kind of thing. Yeah, exactly. And it's like when you start believing it's real. But then that's also how you get fire festivals. Like, yeah, totally. There's a lot of fire festivals out here. Right. Because you have to have the balance of, like, what you, you have to know what you're talking about. Yeah, so and know like, how you're about to dive fire, in it. Like, fire Festival is, like, I mean, someone procedure. that doesn't know about music. Exactly. Trying to do a music festival. Or like, wearing a rock band tee that yeah, you've exactly. never heard the band. But, you, you know, know, like, yeah. I think, you know, like, I think you know, I you know the context wish we of what you want to do. in that scam. I know, right? <laughs> Wait, what? Like, the drama. I wish we were involved in that. <laughs> you were? I you wish you we were. Ja Rule, man. I will. Should I mention this? Yeah. I did talk to Leela about it. She said that Who's she, Leela? Leela. Leela also worked with us. I okay. talked to her about this a long time ago. And oh, she, yeah, Leela. Okay. Leela kind of told me she did see an email that she didn't, like, she already knew it was a scam. Right. right. She did see some sort of, like, festival, fire festival email, like, that came in, like, work emails as scam. Right. Well, we could have been a part of that, like, Damn. scam. That would have been so fun. I, I, I got them. I was. This close to having them at the film festival. The oh, wow. <laughs> I went to their office and I met Shit. them. I met all of them. That's cool. Through uh, Fuck Jerry. Yeah. And, but there was like two weeks, two weeks of time. And wow. they they got to think about it too much. Right. So then they all left town <laughs> on the day of the festival. Yeah. Yeah. Real talk. Yeah, that was crazy. That. Who were some of the other people that were like part of the core crew of in HBA? There was so much. Y'all also did music. Oh, we named it. And everything. Yeah, name everyone. Name them. Them. Oh, Roast I keep, them. Toast I them. Smith. I keep Smith. Okay. And that was the only person, right? Core, core, core. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, glad I don't know. Um, James. I'm not naming names. Oh, okay, I'll name names. It's James, Paul, James Garland. Okay. Accessories. Okay. Legend. Paul, Kupo, another legend. Um, Zach, very legend. I hate Zach. Zach, you hated it. Zach, right? He he worked at Vfos. He actually yeah, hated he used to be the, Yeah, I hated him so much. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but these people are strong in their fields. I've learned now that right. I've grown to accept that people are actually strong in their fields. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you know, all little negativity that I may have had towards them were just me carrying and not accepting that they're strong in their field. Right, right. And like oh. accept that they're strong. Strong in that field. In that field. Yeah. I may be weak in that field, right. so I need them. Like right. so, it's like I'm learning to like be a, an yeah. adult and need rather than yeah. yeah. But these are people that are strong and has helped out a lot. Mm -hmm. HBA, Lila, um, who else? Venus at night. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, how'd you guys look with Venus? Well, Ghetto Gothic, you know this. That was her baby, you okay. know, and you know, like we weren't gonna stop the day of creating passion and right. not. We weren't gonna stop that day to put all the energy at night as we wanted to. Yeah, so right, like Shane right. said before, like we had to collaborate in some cases. Yeah. But we were blessed to own... Like all that energy we were blessed to own Venus. All that night nighttime yeah. energy went yeah. into Ghetto Gothic. We were so. blessed to be a part of Foundation right. yeah, in right. general. So yeah. like all think, these opportunities... What... All these opportunities happen for everyone else. Yeah, know, like yeah. Even Ghetto Gothic was an opportunity for us because we were able to go out at night and Shane could DJ. Shane yeah. goes for DJ. Yeah. Um, we also needed a model for the next day. I could have grabbed a kid from you the party. It's like all yeah. these things were working for us. And the, the aesthetics like fed each other. Yeah, and, and exactly. So it was like, yeah. So Venus at night. Yeah. Uh, that's kind of the core. I don't want to get too crazy and say it's too a lot crazy. of names. That's, that's no, I, think that, I think that's pretty much the core. Yeah. Zach, Zach actually started really early like helping out. Like even, like he, you know, was the one that brought V files into the picture and like to be honest, it was really cool because V files didn't have a uh, identity at the time. Yeah, you guys gave them. So that. we gave them that. But in return, Based. you guys both. That's like you guys were kind of one of the most successful in like, yeah, feeding. Yeah. Both it was basically sides. like having a storefront of our own. Yeah, basically. Well, that's what it was. And you know, like so, like they got they. I guess you know they continued the lineage of like 
oh, this is a storefront for for those brands, kind of brands, you know? yeah. And then they try to fo- follow that, right? Exactly. But they were going, they weren't. There was like a yellow brick road, and then there was like the other one. Yeah. yeah. And then they they chose the other one. <laughs> no, no, but like in the sense where right. in the sense where they didn't uh, they didn't necessarily uh, keep like focal. Like I feel like right. when when uh, like a focal point. Like when we were there, there was a huge focal point because right. they were like that not that many brands. But then they started doing that for everybody. Everybody. So it became like a almost like a trade show. Yeah, or something, yeah, like or a yeah, that's what like a carpet poncho thing going on. We just had to pull out. We realized yeah, exactly. that, like, all right, well, this is great. It was great, but we have to pull out because yeah. you're you're starting to get an identity, and this identity doesn't match who no. HBA's person is. Totally. Well, it's kind of like when um, when like a like a it's like a like a all right. So like a guy makes a joke, and it's like oh that's funny, and then he's just like making like a million jokes. Yeah, yeah. and it's like oh my god, all right, like chill. You didn't yeah. have to take it that high right, exactly. of a stunt you're to like, deliver the joke. <laughs> right. I mean, it's okay. He's like, like, like he's not nudging that. you, and you're like, yeah, okay, yeah, girl. All right, like, chill but out. you're if funny. These things gotta... convert to dollar bills. They don't hear any of that. Right, right. It's no, so totally. You can say all this. You know, and this yeah. is converted into hundreds of thousands. Right. Yeah. Corner of Mercer. Fuck you. Right, right. I'm gonna make coin. I'm gonna. If you don't want to do it, I'm gonna have to do it myself. So, no, totally. So once again, being the foundation for other people. Yeah, yeah. You have and to I accept that we are the foundation. The we, can, foundation. we can lead you halfway there, but you're gonna have to pick so it up and far. move on. And I think, yeah. and I think with, I think that's with, how it goes. I think we're also okay with that, like that. Yeah. You know, yeah, like the, yeah. the fact that everyone, can, we gave people a chance to flex themselves, and I think yeah. that's what is most If you flex important. wrong, then like, right, you know what I mean? What do you want? And you know, you know, more than, you know, I think like that was like the give and take. It's like, okay, like, uh, Say like if I want to make uh you know a, a parakeet's vest, right, right, I'm gonna right. go to like a uh, animal, you know what I mean? Right, like right, someone right. that does that. But I'm giving you the 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 space so that you can perform right. because that's the kind of um, initiative like people expect from the brand is like high performance. High performance, you know what right. I mean? And I think like theatric. That's what that's what it was always about for me. Yeah. Uh, with anybody, I felt like. A lot of people that worked with us were strong personalities that can't work with other people even to this day. Oh, even yeah. to this day, yeah. yeah. Like, but it's not their and fault. It's just kind of how they are. This, yeah, yeah, exactly. And it's not even it's, a it's fuck okay. you to them. It's and just it's like, okay. we're just different. Like, But yeah. that's why we fucked with each other in the first place. Yeah, exactly. It's because like we saw that in each other. Yeah. But like... I'm I'm growing in this direction and yeah. it's not personal. And Exactly. And but, totally. They're yeah. all grown. Yeah, well, in their from, fields now. I could totally. super like you know. Yeah, relate to that one. So yeah, with spaghetti boys, um, mm-hmm. uh, yeah. you go through it. I mean, it happens. <laughs> oh, <to>, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it just it happens to the to the to the greatest teams, and, yeah. and, and you always have to. You know what I mean? Uh, it's not even a yeah. I just had a question on Steve. <laughs> which one is this? Steve? I have such a question. Who's Steve? Father Steve, right? Yes. Oh. oh. We tried to get him for a helmet. I don't know what the fuck happened. We tried to get... He's the one that looks like helmet. Right, right. Uh-huh. We tried to get him to walk helmet, but still mad at you for that. Oh, damn. That's true. <laughs> That's true. We also clean up other, uh, other houses. If you want to get into that question, I don't know if we're going to go there. I was, oh, yeah. Let's go. Uh, Wait, hold on. Oh, sorry. Fuck! <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Cue card, go! Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. When, yeah, yeah, it's it's crazy because it's like you guys can kind of take any house, but w- when when you go in and you leave, it's in shambles. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh man. Talk 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 to me about that. I think like yeah. what happens when like <laughs> what, when we've been in those moments, we've always like. People think that they're gonna work us out, right? right. You know what I mean. <laughs> they think that they're gonna they're gonna get black validation. They're gonna right. get right. all That's the streetwear right. kids That's or so whatever. Funny. And we're like, no, no, no. Actually, we're gonna talk about you yeah. Yeah. and what you, you should, should be do. focusing on yeah. right. and doing. So I think That's that, and it's it's a very right. hard concept for people to grasp right. because right. essentially that all they're asking for us is to black give them put your black face on it yeah. and at so um, the sticker. We can you know what I mean? It. Yeah. And when we give them something that they yeah, actually like, like is high level or whatever or they need or whatever, they can't handle it. They're yeah. like, I don't know what the next step is. And it's like, well, you need to hire us. Yeah. You know, like but also like 
you know, it's all about. I, I mean, they're really, they're the really progressive ideas. Yeah. I, I don't know what else to the say. The black like, validation got me. I yeah. think it's That's not. Crazy. It's, it's it really is not. And they get something else. They get designed and they like actually don't know how to handle that. Right. When they get real collections and real pieces that they actually yeah. have to sell to people in real right, ways. Right. Um, it was, yeah. Uh, you know, and I think like that's our version of anarchy is like making people start to think again. Right, it's right. like not like fucking you up like well that's even the a, same the same energy I try to carry right. that you guys birthed it's right. like literally like I'm I try to live through that and right. get that same exact because I'm looking around and I'm just like wow it's this it's this like the right. gates are this open that no Why? one's just going in and just like <laughs> you know what I mean where? it's like <laughs> the end of the Truman Show yes. when Jim Carrey gets to like he's on the boat and he's yeah. at the end and it's just hitting yeah. and he's like literally. oh wait this is, like, <laughs> so and there's a staircase that just like leads out. Yeah. Like that's what I the agree. game is at right now, and and yeah, there, there are no more like Lady Gaga's that are trying yeah. that or right, even right. trying to push it. That there isn't a team like you guys that's there in place anymore. It's kind of like it's it's in shambles. I mean, Literally. when and you guys think, did to even even when you guys went uh, and, and did Komar, yeah. To be fairly honest, nobody had heard of Komar. Yeah, yeah. And you guys made these amazing coats. Like, I mean, not even just coats. Just like, all the pieces are so. And honestly, I am not being mean to white people again. I just want to say that. <laughs> no, no. But no. you know, you guys are really strong in capitalism. Right. You know, like, yeah. just follow up with it. Yeah, if you still like, you know, that. like battle. If you want to battle yeah. that team, you know, like at least follow up. You they want to give you a piece and, 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 and just let you put your name on it, but they right. exactly. yeah, really they should give you the power to turn the key. If I was I'm really not, believe in I don't the design. believe in the capitalism, in but it. if I was the one with the money and was like, oh, I need this black validation, yeah. I'm going to get the black validation, but I'm also going to follow up and remove you. Mm. And right. just remove you from anywhere. Just because yeah. I got the validation now, I already paid for right, it. Right. Now I already see how you work, I already paid for that too. Yeah. So I can just move on, but they're not doing that. There, there's no follow up. So yeah. everyone just goes down in shambles. Yeah. <laughs> and I think that they, I think sometimes they don't realize, like, once once they actually get into the process of, like, how we do things. Right. Like, yes. that we are working on that level that the other kids work at on, in the house. That's a great point. Okay, you know right. what I mean? Hold on. So they think that we're going to be like, oh, we're cool. Yeah. yeah. Look at these cool Well, this um, is something that I saw. Photos that we're bringing in. That's and true. it's like, we're not like that. We're like, That's actually true. like, let's drape. Let's get in this shape. Yeah. You know what I mean? Well, and this is this is what I was going to say, okay? Because I was doing yeah. crazy Nardwar type research yesterday. Yeah. Trying <laughs> to find as much as I could. I, What'd you find? I found, I found, uh, not a lot, but I found enough. Right. <laughs> I had enough. Right. <laughs> um, <laughs> you had had enough. Yeah, I saw, I saw the, uh, the, 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 the show studio documentary on the, the trans show, mm -hmm. and, which I thought it was cool knowing you guys. What trans I, show? The Fall Winter 14. Fall Winter the 14, yeah. the Vogue one. That was a trans show? No, that's that's what, what, yeah, trans, that's a, yeah. yeah. Did you not catch all that? Who's you were, calling that a trans show? You weren't in the video. But that wasn't a trans show. No, but you weren't there when Shane called, called it. Shane called, yeah, Shane called it. Wait, <laughs> <laughs> <Come on, laughs> <bro. laughs> <laughs> bitch, hello. Ah! Yeah. It's transforming. Okay. Yeah. Transgending. Okay. Come on, get it right. Okay. Oh, I, I, I shut down anytime Shane says anything London. Okay. Like, right, right. Well, when I'm talking, he just leaves the room. As soon he as he says, as soon as he says anything UK, right. yeah. Nick, Damn. anything UK, I'm like, yeah. have your bike. Okay, okay. <laughs> have your bike. You want to show there? Absolutely. Uh -huh. not. We haven't showed there since. Okay. Like, Hubei, you have not seen us in the UK wow. since. Because yeah. even them being the ones who, you know, used to be the head of right, councils, right, right, yeah. don't even understand no. the, the, the foundation of style. Well, this is what I council, noticed. You know? And this is what it I noticed because I watched the panels. I, like, not just saying this to say it, I, like, really were listening they, well, just to what right, they said. Well, right and before I was that, but right before the next studio yeah. was our first entry into your into um, right, right. UK. <laughs> and then Shane did something that was never done in UK. Yeah. We, we did an HBA with, uh, what was it, Browns? Selfridges. 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 With Selfridges, tore it. Parking lot. I hate lots, to say it, but we tore it. Full. 
um, yeah. thousand bucket hats on one person. Wow. Um, <laughs> monument museums yeah. in parking lots skateboarding yeah. off of Selfridges. This is yeah. the Macy's version Benz of trucks, Europe. Playing yeah, so music. these things were happening mm-hmm. before Nick even said, who are these people? Who are these people, right? So right. Shane was already buzzing, but the UK didn't know how to accept it. The council yeah. were like, what the fuck is this guy doing? And then this at the crazy. time... You know, like... And then at the time, it's like, these are, like, the top people that get to film it. Exactly. So it might come out amazing. Let's just do it. Exactly. So I watched it. Exactly. And what they what they showed, they what the entire video, 20 minutes, it, it just shows you, it shows you guys stressing out days before the show and only kind of saying the negative things like, oh, well, we don't know about this venue. You really have to be creative to, like, make it cool, which yeah. is right, right? Just shows you stressing and then, like, you guys kind of just joking around and... What angered me, because I know you guys, is that they didn't show the other side, where it's, like, serious. And it's, like, kind of, like, making it perceived as, like, yeah, you guys just joke, play fight, and then, like, stress out about shit going around. We also kind of never really allowed people to see that. People to see that, because that's where the 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 vibe was. Because that's where you wouldn't even be. That's where the vibe was. Yeah, you wouldn't even be That's where certain ideas, you, like, this NDA tattoos on my fingers. Because it's like those are certain ideas yeah. that like you can't even tell certain girlfriends that you invite to the studio because right, like right, right. they were a little bit narcissistic and didn't know what they wanted to do and also probably and there was a lot of back, yeah. back yeah so there was a lot of back we were never like, really those people to invite people during the creative process right but this is also Shane learning to transition from being a head designer to being a CEO of a whole of a situation whole so now he has to kind yeah. of say yes to certain things that me and the rest of the team I'm like. Uh, this is not us. Yeah, this is not what we do. But certain things he would have to say yes to, yeah. just because he's now business. This is now business CEO. It's way above our it's heads. Way above, it's way above yeah. what we know as creative. And this is what the look is. Right, he right, has to right. not think about the other things. Business. Yeah. How are we going to eat? Just because we know what the look is. Yeah. So with that being said, he has to also like persuade and collaborate with these right, certain right. things and do certain things like Nick Studio right. and say yes to certain things. Yeah. Which opened up a whole other door that we had to figure out. Okay, who? What are we gonna do in that case? Because now we're letting you into the core, right, which right. is our coin. Yeah, and we already see how you girls are. Like you grab and you go, right, right. and you grab hang and up go. and you remake. Yeah, so exactly. like we didn't figure that out yeah. right, or maybe we figured it out right. Maybe you figured. Maybe it, it was happening in transition, and you yeah. knew it was happening, but you we're kind of hoping that you were wrong. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. Exactly. exactly. You, you maybe this time. I'm hoping that yeah. maybe it would have been okay. a bit. It's like yeah. like More going positive. to Kanye's office. Yeah, cause yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of that's you read. Like, <laughs> New York. I mean, the way that the way that uh, those reviews would go. I mean, like I don't really actually care, right. but the way that the reviews were going along was as if like we weren't allowed to get the credit for our work ever. Ever, yeah. You know what I mean? It was yeah. like, okay, so like, it's like, know your place. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right. Know your place. Yeah. You, how, like, and anything is like, they would like, be like surprised when we knew references. I'm like, right. we're designing collections. Why don't, why wouldn't you think that we know yeah. those collections? Yeah. And don't you think that we are knowingly referencing those things? <laughs> you know what I mean? And we're just like, oh my God, that looks like Helen Lang. Yeah. Yes, yeah. because I'm referencing <laughs> Helen Lang. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, don't like, try to blow it up. Like, yeah. I'm shady. It's like, when like, no, Raph like, does a collection based on Helen Lang, it's like, oh my it's God, like, oh, that was yeah, genius. Yeah. Oh, so good. Yeah. It's like, but when we do it, it's like, we're ripping it off or uh, doing something that we don't know about yeah. or something. And it's like, <laughs> right. why is that yeah. conversation not the same thing? Yeah, also, why are we not in the conversation of when their girls rip us off and yeah. they can't just say this looks like Hood by Air Spring Summer Yeah, because no, because then it's tacky and then in that situation. That was yeah. when it became yeah. like too much for me, like right. with the I reviews. Take a step back. Yeah, yeah, I was just like, I just can't be in this conversation. Yeah, anymore. one of the worst times. Because you yeah. can't it's level up. It's right. It's yeah. just like I can't be well, in they're this trying to put you on a certain level. Yeah, or put you next to like a joke like that like, mom. Yeah, and exactly. being a part of well. New York's underground when we're <laughs> we're literally rated the top show for three seasons straight. Yeah. But like we're still cre- underground yeah, makes so absolutely no sense to me. You know what I mean? And I like I love everyone that Black supported us. Right. You know what I mean? Right. Exactly. And it's like yeah. it's like people like like almost now, I guess after like we left, there's a lot of like reparations that like a lot of these like um majority Feel white like people, blanks. you know, yeah. have where they're like, Oh, we fucked up, we right. missed out on all these like a lot of these uh 
you know, black people, people of color. Oh yeah. shit, let's create something. Yeah. Let's, yeah. cre- right. let's, let's create, right? Let's create something. Some, you know? <laughs> I mean, that's, 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 that's what that's I've been seeing in the last yeah, couple of years. Yeah. Is that's what I feel like it is. I it's love like it. I mean, if that's what it takes to get it's the girls guilt. in, I think yeah. it's cool. Yeah, I think yeah. it's cool I mean, too. it's fucked up how it is. How it is. It's fucked yeah. up. It's a little fucked up on the other side of girls who's doing it. But if that's what gets the girls with color in the door, that's what's up. No, it's true. I mean, like, damn, Tuffa was going at it for how long? For a long time. Jesus is like, come on, sis. Long time. You know what I mean? It's I'm like, but it, how, really. how, really? And then you like have like weird people like, I mean, not like reading them because I know what the the point of their collections are, but right. like you have like Robert Geller become really famous. Right, right. And well, then it I would just be like, name you know what I mean? I'm just like, yeah. how is that person ahead it's of true. Telfar? What I don't get is yeah. like black excellence and then black creatives. I think they're two different categories. Yeah, yeah. I think black excellence is worried about the status quo of where we stand right. as a society of black people. And then there's black creatives that actually keep shit moving. Keep it moving. In general. Right. They create stuff that makes the world move in general. Right. And people are focused on black excellence right now. Opposed to black creatives. Yeah, so yeah. black creatives that's are not good. being like really pushed to the oh forefront. You know what I mean? Wow. So you have like you have like everyone that is hitting the status quo, allowing us to elevate yeah. in society, in the civilization that we live in right now. Yeah. And you know, that's where the conversation so the black yeah. creators are sort of down here. Like even look at like the progression of like Telfar's collection. Right. Telfar is like doing a historical thing right now. Yeah. He's not really doing like a Anyway, but people know him for what he does now, <laughs> yeah. and like he's moving yeah. forward like moving that. Forward it's not like, like Telfar is necessarily making large collections of really extremely new ideas, right, right, which is right. where his the base of his collections began. Yeah, you know what I mean. I think like that's what I feel like I want to help like the the black creatives right. to get their that's own good. space. That's you know like I mean? one of the best things I've heard yeah. is the uh, the black creatives against black excellence or what they perceive as black yeah, excellence. Yeah, because then, they, then yeah. they because catch it's like a suited it. black man who's yeah. like... No, totally. You know what I mean? The, the, because the white kids that get it, it from the beginning already know about it and then they wait until it's old and then the, then the black excellence kids, then they get into the look. Right, right. After it's been validated yeah. by the white person. Um, Oof, the cycle. So deep. But, you know, there that goes. Um... <laughs> But not it's not the case of everything. I'm just saying like that is like a pattern. No, it is. And I think that black it excellence is. is amazing. I think it that is. we should, is. you know, it's like it's very amazing to see. Yeah. Because the confidence is so high. No, and it's there. Yeah. You know what I mean? The the ego is like it's crazy. It's insanely amazing. It's good to see black people feeling that good about things. Um, but Yeah. I yeah. don't know if the conversation is moving forward. No, but there's me, I don't know if the concepts are moving forward. Yeah, the concepts, the concepts are, the, the the concepts are, are moving, moving forward. But the concepts aren't. The concepts are like. Because even, even, even the black excellence will sometimes look down on the black creative. Yeah. And oh, think, that's the main yeah, thing. Yeah, that's the main yeah. thing. That's the main thing. Titles. Is, what's happening? Yeah. yeah, well, you start with a title. You yeah. Like, that's the main thing. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, like, I'm, you yeah. know, I've been hearing yeah. crazy shit where it's like, you know, like, superstars would be like, oh, are you, like, Asking like, are is your team black? Right, right. And I'm like, well, wait, what does that matter? Is my team cool? Is my team cool? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, let's talk about that first. If you want to look fab, right, right. Not everybody's gonna be white or black. Yeah. Right. You know what I mean? Like, you need to get into that. The conversation that we were trying to start was that everyone that's cool hangs out with each other, and we and all just into, being cool and we're in that race, vibe. Age, and no one ever said that. It's like the rest of everyone that's making up these storylines. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Because they need to deal with it. Because their generation had to deal with, you know, not being included in the conversation of creativity or whatever. Yeah. Um, I, think it's a, I think it's a granny thing. Yeah. And I, I think, think it's, it's a granny thing. I it's think a granny it's a, thing. a title thing. You know, like our yeah. generation was titled as Generation X. Right. right, right, also, right. Let's also say that we've already been labeled. Right. by society and government as right. Generation X. So we're living up to that standard yeah. and trying to remove that standard and create concepts that we didn't even, that we thought was yeah. Disney. Or yeah, like, yeah. now what? Game of Thrones. Yeah. Kind of thing. So it's like, <laughs> we didn't know what, we didn't know because we were labeled and you know, we didn't right. go in once again with a label. Like it was, yeah. we went in with totally. the the baby first. Yeah. Before giving the I baby mean, a name. Jesus, even though, the know, baby will be in labor. Yeah. It's like, no, we're not 
no name first. No, yeah. I mean, and that's, I think that's also why the questions got even, like, wilder. Because it's just like, at what point are you going to stop calling the streetwear? Right, right. Oh, and what? Kevin Amato, too. Right. Forgot to mention Kevin, Kevin Amato. Kevin Amato. Great, great. Is a mother. Taught me a lot. Taught me a lot when it comes to casting. Yeah. Now I can cast Kevin Amato is lit. Yeah. Like, Kevin, Kevin taught me lit. a lot when it comes to casting and shooting. We're, we're not even um, photographers. Wow. Mm-hmm. You know, we learn so much from our friends. We're like, honestly, if Shane had an idea, nobody was around. And yeah. it was just us two. She, no, it's true. It. And Loire, too. And, of course, Raul yeah, taught me Raul. aesthetic. Yeah. You know, like, Raul taught me aesthetic. Like, if you could put all these people in one room. Raul's a really good stylist. You could put, yeah, you could put all these people in one room, is what I'm saying, yeah. without support and without staff. Yeah. And walk out with The gold. craziest shit ever. Right. I agree with that. Yeah. That's very true. Yeah. You know, gold. That's very true. The minds just, like, know each other. The Raul minds, had the wings under hands. his rock. And he was like, yeah. everyone, you need... Bro. Step out on these wings. Right. Yeah. That's and cool. Like, yeah. He suggested that as 100%. well. 100%. Like, he totally winged up. Yeah. yeah. Was she was like, oh, and by the way. Oh, <laughs> it was very <laughs> that. Yeah. It was very that. Way. I gagged with that one. Because it was at night, too, and I was like, ooh. <laughs> That's a little nasty. I saw it in person. Oh, yeah. Curran was Karen. Curran was, Curran was actually Karen. That was so funny. Actually, Aaron was actually Karen. Yeah. Yeah. But Curran was Karen. Right. <laughs> that was a moment. Yeah, but yeah, it's sure. about that. It's yeah. about bringing that back again, you know. Right. You know, I mean... Show queens forever. Yeah, <laughs> like, like that uh, was, that's it. I think what needs to be sh- like struck, like have a, there needs to be a striking of, like how can people appreciate black creative and also make it black excellence at the yeah. same time and why that cut that separation out. Yeah, you know what I mean. Some people are just creative. You need to help them and allow them and create that space to for them that, to yeah. do that yeah. and grow and like you know what I mean. It's almost like. They're, they're waiting for you to become vintage yeah. so that they can take the whole record. So they can board. take it. They can take you know what I mean? Th- wow. And like, sure. you know, they're like, oh, <laughs> shit's gonna burn out. Boom. And that's why I stopped wow. too, because I was like, you know what? Burnout? I'm gonna wow. keep it cute because you want me to burn out. So you yeah. can be like, oh, actually, like, you know what I mean? And so, like, <laughs> fuck. Um, you know, this is what I've noticed, like, speaking, like, even like, well, I had a friend, like, back in the day, he said, there could only be one of us in the room. Right. And I was like, that's when I like started about? like looking at that sounds crazy. Like Yeah, like, who says said, that? Yeah, they were like I was like, excuse you? Yeah. And like they just changed my whole perspective of like what black power nice. is and what it means. Like to I'm me. gonna be the right. one black person. Yeah. 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 And so it was like it's almost like you were saying you have to allow the the one black person to reign. Right. Because there could only be be one black person like in that right. in that right. sort of conversation. The cool and, black eye. Yeah. Exactly. And, you know, I think, like, where we're at is, um, you know, I think we're just in a little bit of a sheet moment, but I feel like, um, I feel confident. I'm, like, pretty yeah. confident in, like, like where things are moving to. I don't know. How do you feel? See, this is stuck up. I think, um, I think it's a lot of half bottle wines. <laughs> yeah. um, like corks back in kind <laughs> right. of situation. Yeah. Trying to um, keep it hot, but it's really not. It's a lot of, but not, it's not a lot of preserving. Right. <laughs> it's like the meat's in the freezer, but it's not in the deep freezer. Right. right. It's like, uh, like things are moving, but it's not like, mm. the seasonings are getting right. smaller and smaller. Damn. You know? Yeah. You're getting it's... food, but like, <laughs> Seasonings are getting smaller, I think. Yeah, and it's just like, um, and I don't want to be, you know, paranoid or whatever. I just think that you I know, think money talks do you, a lot too. Yeah, it's like how do you control your influence? Sometimes, yeah. you, like when you're in that situation, you just have to figure out how do you control your influence because if you're not capitalizing off of it, why even show? Yeah. Also, you got to figure out what why you want. even do it. Like, if you want money, then you do some certain things for money. Right. Like, if you want foundation and you want to own culture, you do certain you do things certain that things do that. Yeah. You know, like. That's it. You choose yeah. your own lane, you know. But you mm-hmm. obviously already have a foundation from the girls yeah. on what to do, yeah. how you want to do it. Right. Strengths or weeks, you know, right. like whatever you want. Damn, that's true. That's true. Oh, good Lord. Damn. It's true, though. <sighs> it's true. So many facts. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What do you think about 
Like all the British kids. <laughs> <laughs> like which ones? Uh uh-uh, uh, don't say. <laughs> like you know, like. Am I talking about? Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, but we. Can you talk know, about. I'm saying British. Y'all yeah. know exactly what I'm talking about. British, like the cold, yeah. that whole crew. The crew. Who's the crew? Yeah, I don't mm-hmm. know. Y'all Ooh, doing too much. A lot of British. The fashion Ooh. British kids. Okay. Of color. Oh. Okay, now I was thinking, how do y'all feel about the British kids? Because I kind of right. like feel like they have such an opinion on culture from an outside perspective. Outside perspective. Because they cultivate things yeah. and refine it, like as a culture in general. And like, I've, because it's an English speaking thing, I feel like they feel more connected to like things that we may do over here. Right. But at the end of the day, they still are doing exactly what like. Because I think, well, white people, white people do. Yeah, <laughs> okay. Okay. yeah. No, European, no, European, I don't awesome. know these British kids that we're talking <laughs> about, but I will say that, um, Brit- like that British culture has the support of like music to and lift them society. up, to lift, yeah, and society <laughs> to like lift them up as a visual. We also have that, but we have more than that. Way more. Way more to offer, which which is we why just they kinda, had to get in it. Yeah, which is why they may lack, or people may think that they lack. Yeah. In certain things, but like I think they have a music side to lift them up, as opposed to us who have like culture. And it's not even as strong, even on the music know, but it's side. It's also not a battle. But you because know, I'm like, also saying that because like I'm just it's not like a for me it's like. Just how CFDA is now stepping up their game, right, you right. know what I mean, and like how they've had that for so long, like right. that is like built into their culture, yeah, like yeah. giving coins to the youth, like supporting right. the youth, and like how, like it's almost like when are we gonna get over it being like a privilege to be like that way, and that, and that's like a necessity for like the young kids to actually succeed here, you know, like I don't know, I mean that kind of goes, ugh. that kind of goes to like. Like, why do, like, new rappers still in 2019 care about XXXL's uh, opinion? Right, right, right. It's just, like, it doesn't matter. Validation. And right, it's, right, like, right. the validation. And it's, like, we're all so... so it's, like, before you had to get the validation mm-hmm. because we didn't control the cameras and we didn't control what you saw. It's kind of, like, now we, like, have... Yeah, it's weird when it comes to validation. And I try to think about it. I mean... It's not weird. It's the you choose if you want to be a leader or not. Or not, yeah. It's not weird at all. But being a leader, you have to sacrifice so much. You really yeah, do. being uncomfortable first. Yeah. And like once yeah. you realize that, then you'll move yeah. or you'll grow from that. Yeah. You have to make these decisions first. Yeah. You can't go ahead and be like, oh, well. Yeah. And know, I always... I wrong was, weapons. Yeah. I always work. try different techniques to like kind of humble myself before I even get to a point mm-hmm. of becoming super... I'm doing super, that more now. Yeah, really. Like old, yep. Yeah, you yeah. have to. That's something that you have to teach yourself all the time. I'm, I'm guessing now. Yeah. Like, go yeah, into humbling. it being just go into it being like yeah. humble. Well, I, I I've lived through so watching so many people who were older than me yeah. and and kind of almost just self destructed. I was telling people just do yeah. that, and you know, it's like when do you? But also like a person like that, like it's like oh, fuck it, like. <laughs> A person that is, uh, you know, of that caliber, right? Yeah. Like, that is a, like, a mentor, like, a, a beaming light that, like, starts it. It's like, when do you, when are they allowed to say that they did that? Or when, because, like. Because they're never allowed to. They're never really allowed to. No, because it's you're always You're never like really allowed to say that. I did this. Or you, you know, crazy. in a business context. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, maybe personally. Like you are if you have a plan. If yeah, yeah, yeah. If you have, you have a leadership a plan. plan, you are. But if yeah. you're not, you're just going into it. It's so easy to become. No, because it's hard hates. because everyone yeah. thinks that you're actually being cocky and you're just like yeah. you want to talk about your own aesthetic, but sometimes it's like almost off limits. Yeah. Because it's too obvious. Slash, like also, there's another thing too. It's like people that are referencing it don't really say that they're referencing it. Right. So it's almost do. like you're like waiting. At least could like, be that. Yeah. You know what I mean. That. You know what I mean. It's just like well, someone outside of that person that we were talking about. Yeah. Should say it because yeah. they know him, yeah, or, or her, or her, to do that. Yeah, and is it the person that really started it? Is it their duty to be boast, or is it yeah. the people that 
have been fucking with them, is it their duty to say it? You know right. what I mean? When when does it become like, uh, like when when does that happen? Like when does that conversation happen? Mm. What do you think? But you I almost feel like sometimes I just want to come out like I feel like a young kid and be like, oh yeah, and then so people figure out. And then they look. They do a backstory on me, and then they figure out, oh, he actually did this or that. But you yeah. never know. I don't know, like if people even do that anymore. What like, go check out backstories? Yeah, people I, like me. Right. But they're good. I don't know so if many. do that. Do people? I think a lot of people's blind. Yeah. Culture's a bit blind. Um, all they see is validation. Once yeah. Again, yeah. 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 Um, that's a really good thing, the validation thing. Right, um, right. I also think there's still a lot of sheeps. I yeah. think um, there should be more conversations on leadership <laughs> right, right. right now Yeah. in all areas. Right, like yeah. if, if you are a creative director, that's what you want to be, I think you should like attach yourself to someone who is mm. and remove your title and learn. I think everyone just like, <laughs> Start on the floor. That's another thing, learn. too. It's yeah. okay to learn. Like, it's, okay. it's okay to learn. It's okay to... But it's also okay to like secretly... And like humble yourself and learn, yeah. not learn as in like post ideas online so the world learns. With learns you. with you. You're not you asking know. for the world to learn, but you're asking yeah. for you to learn so you that you learn. can teach the world something. Else. Yeah, it's like why not? So like, you can't go to school with too. the world. Like why yeah. is your homework online? What is this? <laughs> like why is your homework on your your socials? Well, what is this? Yeah, you're. Are you going to school for everyone else? Like well, are you making money for everyone else? Or are well, you trying to make money for yourself so that everyone else can? Yeah, make money? no, I feel what like. That's a fact. It's like just ask the person opposed to like yeah. waiting. That's why I just be I'd be like paying it. They're like, oh, when it's high it's up. I'm like, I'm listen, I'm not coming back for, like to to start I'm coming back to do it right for the to fam. To do it right. To do it right for you know for the people that are there that are like the institution of the what was created. Right. Yeah. Not because I'm not trying to be in the, the trend cycle because so that's what I'm building is like a fortress around that so it's protected because like mm. the kids need the kids need that. Like yeah. if the younger kids under me come and they get fucking robbed of their ideas right, right, right. they're gonna look at me the older person you know what I mean? It's like yeah. you need to come to us and hire us and be like yo can you introduce me to that kid? Right. I want that kid to work for me. Right, right, right. True. Initiative. Don't just keep looking at their Instagram. This is nothing new. You nothing know what I mean? Right, right of course. Yeah. This literally sounds like what, if you want a job, this is what you do. Like, yeah, just yeah. ask the person if they want a job. They're bypassing the common yeah. sense of things. I'm yeah. pretty sure they'll say like, yes. They're bypassing normal things that their parents did when yeah. they were young. Right. Like, <laughs> you go around what you're influenced by yeah. and then you learn from it. Yeah. Sensei, hashtag. Like totally. and that's okay. And there's nothing wrong with having an There's Nothing wrong with that. Like, you're investing in yourself. You're not. Totally. You're not. It, I can't read you. Yeah. It's not shady. You're investing in yourself. Yeah, that's it. But they don't want to do that. You know, yeah. they want to like do homework online together. And, like, yeah, right. Show, show and then the it's like, work. it's just really strange, like the way that the press works. And I feel like press. Yeah, I mean, what is press even like? It's like it almost like makes it worse because it like validates what's going on, on Instagram that isn't good that isn't good you know what i mean it's almost like they could control the wave yeah they can yeah. control it because that's why we think that they have taste yeah. i would go right. to vote because, because i think that 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 magazine from the history has taste, has taste yeah. you know what i mean so i'm going to go on vogue.com and look at it yeah if you don't show me taste <laughs> i don't know what the purpose of now me going you know what what yeah. is the purpose of all of these things it's not just to be like consistent it's about to have a taste level yeah and yeah. that is the main issue it's like interesting yeah. feed or taste level yeah. what do you you know and i think or sell and i think that they both product. have valid like they both have, what or sell die prada yeah i think that <laughs> they're, they're both valid yeah. you know and i think that you know that they have their place in the world it's just like i don't know like if that necessarily means luxury yeah i don't know if Consistency in a story means luxury. I think taste yeah. means luxury. Like, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, how about you not post that much? Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? How about I know, but even, not, not even as people, just like in the brand co- context or True. whatever. And yeah. I think like, um, it's like, but the kids don't know how to n- not get to where they want to be without posting and then all their ideas are gone and then by the time and they're already washing themselves they're already washing themselves I can't learn without validation 
Wow. That's, and because that's like, the oh my cycle God, look that at what I did. Stop, and right, then right, that right. picture is in Paris already. Bottom <laughs> yeah. It's clipped on the board. Boom. Wow. It's already yeah. on the board. So the validation is not even worth it. No. Yeah. Because the, the idea is washed by the time they even get their already first ticket to pass. Literally already double you know snapped, I mean? printed out, Damn. waiting for someone else's house in a new collection. So there needs to be, yeah, right, exactly. There right. needs to be like a barter system. I'm having trouble connecting to the internet. Oh, girl. Take Alexa a look at the help says. section in your Alexa app. Alexa. Alexa. <laughs> um, She's in her No, she is feeling right. herself tonight. Yeah. Um, no, I, but you know, I, I'm trying to like... That's what I've been trying to figure out, too. Like, yeah. with the kids, I'm like, okay, how do I, like, work with younger people or people that I like of my age category and not have it be, like, some wasteful right. use using type yeah, feeling, feeling, you know what I mean? But supporting the youth or yeah. supporting ideas for the youth. Yeah, and actually doing and, it. And balance it out, opposed to being like, oh, like, I'm the cool older guy that's right. selling your ideas to really uncool people. Right, right, right. I just think of the cert. You have to you like have to strip the certification. Like mm. you have to strip this like idea of like having this title first and like doing your work and like showing people as soon as it's done online. Oh my god! And this right, also right. goes for musicians. Take your time. This also goes for musicians <laughs> who are quick to upload on SoundCloud. It's the same process. It's like yeah. certain things are not for that because you're not ready to deal with people's response mm-hmm. right there. Right. You're more concerned about people's response it's than cool. the actual. That was product. the thing that happened with HP. Yeah. Like. You're yeah. more like the brand got yeah, bigger than we could even control. Yeah, right, you can't be right. concerned about. I can't be concerned about your idea of what I want to do with my life. No, yeah. totally. I can't. That can't be. That's what is that balance? So it's like. No, I, like friends, like with your your office shoot. I feel like you have you've had that up for like no, but you've had it up, and that is a statement, and you're using it. As, it's not just like another post. It's like, this right. is like a Statement. piece of moment. It's Deal a moment. Right. Deal with it. Take moment. it, come back. Come back. Go next. away, come back again. Come back, yeah. And then next. Right. right. Uh, and then it, it follows up. You know, I think like that's like sort of like... generation doesn't think in that sense. Right. Like, and so it's like, oh, it all out oh, 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 Let oh, me know I mean, what you think about it right now. Right, right, right. Wow, right. you're salty about it? Wow. Right. And I'm still going to make it. And then you make no money from it. Right. right. Exactly. Right. Damn. And it could have been a brilliant idea. Too. It's like almost like it's actually out. always brilliant ideas. Also, yeah, yeah. It's like because nothing's new under the sun. It's not a new idea, yeah. but it's just a brilliant idea. Yeah, like, exactly. Money, you know, mm-hmm. like, but like, it's almost like figure out how to mass market it before you even talk about it. Yeah, right, right. like get that, get yeah, your that. units up. Right. Yeah. And t- if it doesn't sell, take the fucking loss. But at least you know, at least you, know you tried right. to push it out as hard as you could. Like in those in the context of wanting to be on that level, right. sometimes you just don't want to be on that level. Some projects are meant to actually be for the love, right, right. be for the the culture, and those are totally different projects. You know what I mean? Yeah. Those are content things. But like, I don't know. A lot of kids are not That's looking true. for that. Right. They're looking to be on that high level, right. and they put themselves out there too, too much. Too much, yeah, yeah, but in the wrong way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enthusiasm is amazing. Like that's how you get. That's how you hustle. You know, like that's where the hustle comes from. But is that why you don't use social media? Yeah, like, totally. Really why would I? Even, no, I mean it got to the point literally where I would post something and I would be like, okay, you know what? <laughs> I literally went into that bitch's office and my photo was on wow. her mood And yeah. this was like years ago. Right, and that's right, when right. I knew that, that how dangerous it was. To do that. To do that and the, the usage of uh, that sort of thing. And, but does it become a and good self And even the element of surprise. No, I think it can. I it, think can it could become it can very be. self-destructive. I think it's well, dead because of social media. Yeah. Yeah, of course it's self-destructive. Well, no, self destructive to even know the other side and seeing it in a, on a yeah. movie board. Totally. Yeah. Because you're just like, why am I not that person? That's true. Well, that, I that. Mean, it's not that. healthy. It's not healthy. That, and then you're like, oh, well, now I don't want to put myself out there at all. Yeah. And now you're kind of like, you yeah. know what I mean? But That's it's like, true. you kind of do like, yeah. people love looking good and getting the comments. Yeah, course, and it's like, course. there's yeah, like, yeah. No, you have to strike the balance, you know? Yeah. I feel like. Also, yeah. like, breaks... To me, breaks are good for that. You know, yeah. striking the balance. It's like... Right. You already know when a wave is about to get too crazy. You already yeah. know when... Um, or maybe it's that things are getting 
things are going so fast that people are afraid of their par- uh, parts. Yeah. And so they feel like they have to constantly... Totally. I mean, like, I already heard certain rumors when we, when we were, like, you know, sort of, like, is this a decision to do, do hiatus or whatever? I had heard, essentially, everything that was going to happen in the la- that ha- did happen in the last two years. All the pre-planning for that. Wow. And I was like, okay, am I going to sit here and continue to do this and be called underground? Yeah. And... Um, not be validated in a way that, for instance, maybe Mark Jacobs was validated in the 90s. Right. You know what I mean? It's like, what was the difference between those collections and what we are doing? Yeah. And why right. is the conversation different? That's why, right. when Calvin Klein came out, when Donna Karen came out, and they became monsters, and yeah. they became stick, like, literal, like, like, monuments in fashion, what is the difference between the shows that we were doing and that, because yeah. the importance was there right. from the press. You know what I mean? Why is it... So it's just like, am I going to take this chance, you know, to be this person? Like, I don't know. It's your birthday today, right, Chuck? It is. Birthday. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for being here on your birthday. Oh, no problem. This is a good, this is a good way, because I feel like it's, you know... You got to reflect. Yeah, exactly. I don't know, birthday. You got to reflect and reflect. And reflect, yeah. You know, it's also being, it's good being around your sisters. Like, yeah. real sis. Opposed to, like, <laughs> yeah. opposed to, like, party sisters. Yeah. That, like, you know. What would you say are, like, the next steps for you? Both of you, one by one. Um, I've dived into music. Yeah. I'm putting out a few albums. Uh, Fire. Joining a label soon. Oh. Oh. Can you say it or no? Joining la- a label soon. Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Um, and uh, are we gonna, I'm going to wait for Shayna to give the call when she's ready to tear it. Well, she's already started tearing it. Yeah. Like, you know, when it's time to, you know, execute the tear. Right. And then just start again and teach. I think we've already learned that we're, once again, like foundation people. So right, it's like, right. I'm glad we stepped out because there's time for you to make all these mistakes so that when we come clean up again, yeah. now we're not cleaning up for another house, we're cleaning up for our own. For so our like, own. we're giving you a whole other foundation for you yeah. to try again. That's a fact. As young creative artists to try again and just go from that. <laughs> yeah. You know, sure. we've already did it. We just have to do it again. Again, yeah. yeah. Um, right now, you know, I'm building structure. Like, for me, the next steps are, that's what it's all about. I think what we did was passion, like yeah. HBA was passion. So right. now I'm trying to, and that was the initiative. It was like, we're gonna do it, we're gonna, but like, fuck it, we're gonna go into fashion and do fashion for fashion's sake. Yeah. And yeah. we did what we needed to do, we sort of created a foundation there for that. And now it's about creating a foundation for the history and also the business. Yeah. And so, um, that's the steps that I've been taking lately. Like, I've been working on infrastructure and um, stuff like that. And creatively, you know, I've been, you know, I'm really trying to get the tone of how business works for us. Yeah. And, like, also, and then how that leads into lifestyle. So it's sort of like working backwards to the same To the goal. same. You know what I mean? But when so you come the second time yeah. around, you know it better. Yeah. And that's always what it takes. Yeah, because we well, know exactly yeah. what look we want to yeah. get in the yeah, end. Exactly. We just yeah. need to know how to, yeah. the business yeah. right. reaches that, you know, yeah. from the beginning. From, from the, the beginning. Forefront, Which is know? why the comebacks is going to be major. Crazy, you know? yeah. this is what we did it to in the beginning. Yeah. God forbid yeah. this happens now, oh my God. Right, right, that's right. This yeah. is crazy. Now we're... Legend in the business aspect. Yeah, it's a fact. That's yeah, with that's a fact. this concept, it's over. Yeah. To be honest, and that was like what was so confusing about the first time around too, is because like the goal was never to be like a successful business. We just wanted to like teach yeah. people what we were about. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And like the, this business was secondary because like Always. at some point it was like almost like we wouldn't even touch the you know we wouldn't even well certain people you know we wouldn't even <laughs> touch in the coins you know yeah, we were just yeah, like. Yeah. We were just moving forward and forward know. and forward and pushing it, pushing and pushing. Because what we were trying to do was get out of the hood. Yeah, that's yeah. a fact. We were trying to get it to the furthest place away so that people could understand the context of 
this is what this concept is. And it was it putting it in a tube, powers. it goes up the little suction right, hole. Right, exactly. And, it's and like, then ends up on the mood board. Now it's in pa- And like, seriously, <laughs> like, it's like, we were like, every season we were like, oh, no. Okay, so we did that. Now Ooh. we're going to do new fashion else? week. We did that. Now we're going to uh, do Milan. I will say we, we that. tore now we're doing up Paris. Europe. Yeah, yeah, Europe tore, got yeah. tore up. Yeah, we yeah. tore Europe up. The Hood by Air's legacy, <laughs> Europe got it the most. Yeah. So, like, Europe got the beginnings of, like, real production from us. So Europe got, like, ideal dream shows. Well, it was, yeah. Like, they got, New York and Europe, Europe got same season. so much from us. Like, when Shay made the, like, when he came to us, I was like, all right, we going to Europe. We're, it's going to be Europe. Right, right, right. It was no longer this like DIY. Yeah. Come to our Lower East Side show. Right, 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 right. It was uh, we're in Europe. The girls are gagging, and this is also the beginning of relationships. So like budgets were endless. So obviously we were able to make dreams come true. Yeah. Visually and start a whole new uproar. Yeah. But like people need to live up to that now, and like totally. there needs to be a follow up now. So That's I think now we need we need to go back into the surgery of totally. things. Not re- not. Just the surgery in everyone's head about it because the mm-hmm. apparel's there. Yeah. Honestly, all you have to do is turn the apparel back on. Yeah. Even to this day, since the girls have been on break, it still haven't seen. Damn. <laughs> no, it's true. I mean, it's... Uh, it's you know, like... You know, and, and you know, one of the business. projects... Yeah, one of the projects that, you know, I've been working on has to do with the archive. It has to do yeah. with, like, us educating people on things that at least we think are important for them to understand about not only just us but what the effect was and what the inspiration is yeah because sometimes people don't understand that they can get to the same point but have totally different totally inspirations different, yeah. Yeah. and it's it, it can be confusing like someone like it, and that's what was also cool about the brand was like like a punk kid could be like oh i get that and we were like oh no but the way that we thought about it was like this yeah. right. but we actually like the same exact thing yeah. you know yeah. what i mean and Very so true. it's about teaching that to people and so like i'm creating that part of the brand um and yeah just uh, that's it coming with nasty yeah. pieces <laughs> i mean <laughs> making yeah you there's know working two, on nasty pieces um the, and and lastly there's two pieces that i really want you to talk about uh-huh. um talk to me about the the apex twin graphic uh so because that's like a that, that's like history books yeah i mean to be honest there were a lot of collections where the t-shirts were just like straight up made to be legitly like on the fucking runway yeah yeah because like we didn't know how far we could go right right with like legality and all that stuff yeah. you know what i mean so you know the collection that season had to do a lot with uh specific things that um to be honest we were trying to do things that were really cutesy but extremely like evil and in, in in um in the minds you know what i mean yeah. like twisted minds you know yeah. and um that's sort of like where that came from and we were also like trying to get things that looked like mug shots right right the idea was like to get as much face and as much hair or like that vibe um, that structure phase, which is why we referenced Manson. Yeah, yeah, the no Apex, the Manson. Right, that right. was like a sort of era of like long hair. Yeah. Really crazy face. Um, orange face. Or, orange all right, face. exactly. And um, that's kind of like where that came from. I mean, obviously, like Apex is like an insanely huge reference. Right, right. In general, which was so crazy because like, remember how people, like, anyway. Well, yeah. Like, all the street with trades were talking about how the t shirt was evil and yeah. blah, I mean, blah, blah. I, I don't want to mention any names. But I know. I've seen a lot of reapproach. I know. To, yeah. A lot of that. Oh, I see. I see. That's why I've I seen a lot of reapproach and to Apex one. logo. Yeah. Right, yeah. exactly. 100%. Not even HBAs, but just Apex, Apex logo. Apex logo. Right now, which, okay, which is okay. Yeah. Yeah, of course. But we paid. No, of course. And, like, you know, obviously it's a, it's a community, but, like, yeah. Yeah. you know, when you bring things to the forefront, it's, like, weird. Yeah. It's, like, you just, it's weird because you just, like, see, like, you're, like, almost, like, is, are people phony? Because, yeah. like, you literally talk to somebody yeah, you know, and they'll be, like, I hate that. And then, yeah. like, the next season they'll be, like, bitch, like, can I get a, that piece? And you're, like, I, <laughs> I you didn't want that piece. Yeah. But, 
you just tell me you hated that piece. But then, wow. but there was like all that the Manson stuff, and I was just like, it actually was really crazy how far the Manson trend went. Wow. Because like, I mean, bitch, every designer made a, a, a version of it, yeah. you know, at at some point, and you know, obviously we were only do we only made those t shirts. Some of those t-shirts were literally just for shits and giggles. Right, right, right. Like, to just do it, because we thought it would look good with the ideas with the, that were happening right. at the time. Damn. And, like, they became the most popular, so that people would order them. And we were like, okay, well, let's see how this goes. Well, and it goes. wasn't dis- ever disrespect. It was right, trying to rip right. anybody off. It was more so, like, homage. Homage, and we were just yeah, like, oh, fuck course. it. Like, this is, like, what people are ordering. We need to yeah. make this fucking order. Right. Like, literally. And, um... We ended up having to change the Manson graphic to Boy Child and yeah, warping that face. Yeah, yeah. Boy Child. yeah you know, didn't boy talk child. about Boy Child. I mean, Mother Child. That was the point. beginning of us putting, um, instead of putting all confidence and like um, creativity into clothes, putting it into a person. Mm-hmm. Right, right. That was the first um, actual like, mu- moving. New music. Yeah. That was a moving. Was... That was a moving. HBA was it was living. <laughs> wow. It had orgasms. Yeah. Like, that was a living uh, cell right, of totally. HBA in, like, human form. How'd totally. that happen? Just, uh, you know, she was playing around with... Uh, Kevin had found her. Okay. And then L- Lila also knew her, too. Okay. But I don't know how all of that... I don't know how, but happened, we got but her. Yeah, yeah, everyone yeah. kept on, like, being like, oh, like, you should meet Tosh, meet Tosh. Meet Tosh. Yeah. Yeah. Met her a couple times, and then, like, I was like, hmm, like... I like that she was, like, had a, a thick boy's body. Like, it was, like, a dude's body. Yeah. You know what I mean? But, like, the sex appeal was feminine. Right, right. And she just really got the, that point. Yeah. And it was, like, a you know, a, a modeling job for her. So she was down for it. Yeah. And I think it also gave her a platform to... Um, do her thing, like, in front of a bunch of people. Yeah. And, um... And then, like, right after that, then it became, like, the huge thing for every runway show to be performative. I right, mean, like, right, right. After right. that, remember everyone in Paris started battling? Yeah. And then everyone had a performance thing. Yeah. yeah. And their shows. Yeah. Mothers. Yeah, mothers. We respect, but, like, <laughs> you know, it became, oh. Yeah. But <laughs> <laughs> it was also, other things were moving, too. We weren't, yeah. we weren't, we weren't, we weren't the only things moving. Moving, You yeah. know, like, culture was also growing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, trans was a thing all of yeah, a sudden. Yeah, right. Trans in fashion. Yeah, like, right, right. Vogue it. Yeah. Like, all these, like, yeah. Vogue it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all these, like, weird gay things with yeah. norm. Right, right. In, in like fashion shows. Yeah. It wasn't in clothes yet. Mm-hmm. It was in fashion shows. So like, these are norm. Like, oh, trans. Let's let's do this. Yeah. Oh, they look different. Ooh, let's yeah. do this. Ooh, ooh. It was a lot of that, and it wasn't no follow up with it. Mm. Meaning there was no merch plans around it. it was around no trans it, no. Merch. Yeah. yeah. You know. No, and, and then that's off. What... That was HBA's clothing. clothing trans yeah. merch. Yeah. Yeah. Like. This is what we lived off. And I think of. that that yeah. then eventually so like, in like in other houses on. it didn't like. It didn't read well in other yeah. houses when they tried to like and I think people trans began to up or right, like right. do things not norm. Yeah. Oops, wrong yeah. house. It's like <laughs> this is not your world. Damn. It's and not I think your world. I think people began to like figure it out, and then once because then we I also to be honest, I think that we also began to move away from it because we felt like it was becoming gimmicky. Right, right, for, right. Because yeah. it was such a conversation. Yeah, like, it became a conversation. We actually case. like these people. We actually hang out with yeah. these people. These are actually our friends. Yeah. So we're not gonna move into this direction of like whatever. But like, I've learned that you can't be ashamed of what you begin, to, you create. You began, yeah. You know what I mean? You just yeah. cannot. You you have to actually like, just keep going with it. You know what I mean? Fuck. And that, because it wasn't a cockiness thing, it was just more so like I was trying to respect Tosh, and I wasn't trying to be like, "Oh, look how quirky this is." Yeah. And, but you know, the other person in that other European—I mean, sorry, the European—is thinking about it like that, yeah. and they are gonna use her like that. Yeah. So you yeah. might as well just openly, respectfully do it do the it. way that you need to do it. Yeah. Um, you know, and muses. It's a it's a hard thing that you have to learn how to work with, like having a muse, yeah, no. and having mu- you know just like multiple muses and people that you collaborate with in these ways. I think Tosh is like you know the best example of someone that it it worked well with yeah. because she's well, Tosh made it more or less. 
Tosh made it actually diverse, as yeah. opposed to it just being gay black. It was now mm. gay. It was now yeah, like right. there's more to offer in this color chart. Right, and right. It's people of color, yeah. but it's more to offer in this chart. So there is there isn't no like stop labeling us. You know, like, yeah. stop putting these labels on us because every time you do, we still attack you with something new. With something oh, gay new. black trans. Oh, right. now we're eating you out with Filipino trans. Yeah, and she looks stink. Right. And now That's you're true. gagging. That's very for true. For years in yeah. gagging, trying to like <laughs> exclude trying her, to like yeah. excluding her away from us. In certain cases, there were certain cases. I'm gonna say it. Yeah. There were certain cases in the beginning of our relationship with um, with um, with Tosh that we had to us also learning what it meant to have like exclusivity right. in a right. house. Right. This is we also everything. What's crazy is that we're learning the ways of fashion. As we went, as because we, went. we were yeah. weren't about it. That's not yeah. what we were about. Yeah. So we're learning all these ways, right. and we learned that we had to have this this kind of muse situation. Right. And then, but in having that, we also had to learn what it meant to be exclusive, right. which is a new thing yeah. in fashion it again. again. Because you know they only the, the legends were exclusive to right. houses, right. but us becoming a house, we had to make certain models that we exclusive we used that people were starting to like. See that they or were just, the we just people. had to do it anyways because they wouldn't come for it anyways. Yeah, yeah. even if we, we, if we put someone the out there yeah. immediately, they would have tried to. Snap. Oh, yeah. of course, and that of was course. like an email like the day after the show, literally, wow. you know, like that level. And it was yeah. just like, wow, oh, like I'm wearing a barter war for our yeah. friend, damn, yeah. you know what I mean? And it's just yeah. like, it like it's not weird. slavery, yeah, yeah, it's, but it's really like, crazy. Yeah, and um, it's weird because you don't want them to get died out by something else. Yeah. But they don't see it like that because they're like, oh, this is a yeah. job. Yeah, exactly. And it's like, yeah. No, yeah, and it's... It, it's Bigger so, picture. Yeah. Yeah, basically. Bigger picture, shit. No, totally. Damn. Wait, you said two pieces. What was the other piece? Oh, yeah, the double-sided boot. Because mm. oh. I love that piece so much. I yeah. had the honor to take double it with me to Paris. Boot. Yeah, and why didn't that ever get released? Uh, most annoying and uncomfortable boot in the office. <laughs> you thought it was, really? I thought it was so not uncomfortable. Oh, it's so uncomfortable. It's so uncomfortable. Really? I, I thought yeah. I was so into that it. That was but, yeah. a yeah. great. Thing. <laughs> that shut it down. Yeah. 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 I mean, the with the with that boot, the idea was like came from also mockery of like how intense I was being at the time. Yeah. And I think like. It was made as a joke, and I was like, "Actually, no." <laughs> that is crazy. Let's go. So ahead of time. Let's go to that direction. You know, what I mean? yeah. Right. It was the right. Exactly. And you know, it also had to do a lot with, um, yeah, like making it having a, a very useful version of like that trend that that we were trying to get into, and then the very unused, you know, un. Like unusable version, because like what we, we had also done we in a like, timeline so, too. Like we yeah. just came out of what is that? We're talking about spring seventeen. So we just came out of our big suiting moment, spring fifteen. We just came out of our first like fur again, luxury fur in in fall. And right. so we we led up to like oh we're back to schoolgirl with nylons and like we're doing patent leathers and pruned children. And double yeah. heels. Yeah. You're already carrying. Y'all don't know what to expect yeah. from us already. We were already carrying. So, like, yeah. I don't know where no, it's true. Do. It was, like, basically an update. And, like, you know, yeah. of course, that was when we, we began, like, the toe cap thing, which is, I mean, I don't want to. Well, it's everywhere I mean, now. Yeah, it's everywhere now. Um, and so, no like, toes, no you know. Right. You're totally <laughs> we, right. Because, you know, like, what we had. That's you know, also really big out. in fashion, by the way. If your toes well, is not right. Don't have a luck. Yeah, yeah. For <laughs> us, that's that's a huge thing. It's like no what toes. Does that mean? It's no like toes, no toes. Like not a designer. Sorry. No. What's the, there's no look if it's no toe. Mm-hmm. What's the toe? What is your the shoe? toe? Right. It's like, it's like, <laughs> your shoe game. If the shoe okay, game ain't okay. right, if the shoe game so ain't don't right, don't bother doing runway shows. Yeah. Okay. And we learned from that in production, too, because I've realized in other houses, too, this is a big deal where, like, they think about shoes last, they think about toes last, right, and right. then the production of it comes cheap, and then the show mm, looks cheap because of the toes and stuff like that. It starts with the shoes. It starts with the, well, it starts with the idea, but the, the whole person, but the toes is what's, like, yeah, toes get right, your well, toes up. Get the toes up. Because <laughs> then you know how to just do the yeah. rest of the look. Yeah. You're yeah. like, okay, I need, a, I need a casual pants. Right, because my toe. <laughs> you know, because my right. toe is crazy, crazy right. and I need to, like, <laughs> chill it down a little bit, you 
You know what I mean? <laughs> this is also growing up in the hood, knowing that I don't care for fuck what I got on, but my Jordans are the Express. Right, yeah, exactly. It's the same mentality. Of course. It's the same mentality. Yeah. Like, my product is the lit, same I'm good. Like, yeah. I'm good. Like, if the toes is right, toes the whole right. look should follow. There you no, go. That's true. Damn. Thanks so much for coming, guys. Of course. This has Thank been an so honor. Thanks Y'all are the best. Oh, my God. <laughs> huh? Sponsored sub. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sponsored sub. I don't have a glass, oh. but I'll take an imaginary one. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> we got it.